I am here off the coast of Panama where we just recovered what we believe to be the coffin of legendary explorer Sir Francis Drake, who was buried at sea over 400 years ago. Are you sure you want to be defiling your ancestors' remains like that? You make it sound so dirty. <laughs> Besides, thought you didn't believe me. Well, I did do my research, and apparently Francis Drake didn't have any children. Well, history can't be wrong, you know. For example, you can't defile an empty coffin. What the hell? Ah, <laughs> you devil. What is it? Come on, hold it up. Oh, no, 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 no way. Deal was for a coffin. That's it. Wait a minute. If my show hadn't have funded this expedition, hey, hey, you wouldn't you have... got your story, lady. Look, Mr. Drake, you signed a contract. <laughs> I have a right to see no, every single thing that... Could this... you hold that thought? Sully, uh, we got some trouble. Hurry it up. Okay, okay. What's going on? Uh, pirates. Pirates? Yeah, the modern kind. They don't take prisoners. At least not male prisoners. Wait, what are you talking about? Uh, sh shouldn't we call the authorities or something? Yeah, that'd be a great idea, but we don't exactly have a permit to be here. What? Yeah, so unless you want to end up in a Panamanian jail, we should probably handle this ourselves. But well, what's worse? You obviously haven't been in a Panamanian jail. Do you know how to use one of these? Uh, yeah, it's like a camera. You just point and shoot, right? Good girl. Here we go. How the hell they find us out here? Uh, these guys have been tailing me for weeks. Thought I lost them. So what'd you do to piss them off? Uh, it's kind of a long story. These guys don't like you much, do they? Less talking, more shooting! Hurry up, Sully. Oh, <laughs> 
<laughs> I can't leave you alone for a minute, can I? I had everything under control until they blew up the boat. <laughs> you all right? Nothing the years of therapy won't fix. Well, if it isn't the beautiful and talented Elena Fisher. Flattery will get you screen time. Yeah, I'm more of a behind-the-scenes kind of guy. Victor Sullivan. Huh. <laughs> ah, for Christ's sakes. <sighs> what do you say we get out of here before we attract any more attention? Well? A little present from Sir Francis. Oh, so you found the coffin. Wait a minute, is this what I think it is? <laughs> Drake's lost diary. He faked his death, just like I said, Sully. He must have been onto something big. Yeah, well, let's just keep that between us. Thanks for the loan, Mr. Drake. I think I've earned a look at that diary when we land. sailed into the Pacific. He took the Spanish fleet completely by surprise. He captured their ships. He took all their maps, their letters, their journals, and he recorded everything in this diary. Uh-huh, so this... But when he got back to England, Queen Elizabeth confiscated all of his charts and logbooks, including this one, and then swore his entire crew to silence. Yeah, so this... You see, Drake discovered something on that voyage, Sully. Something so secret and so valuable, they couldn't risk it getting out. All right, Nate, just pretend for a minute that I don't really care about any of that stuff and cut to the chase, would you? <sighs> Man only interested in the climax. He must be a real hit with the ladies. Never had any complaints. Okay, then. I'll jump to the good part, just for you. Ho, ho, ho. Huh? El goddamn Dorado. He was onto something big, all right. Does it say anything else? Oh, so now you're interested, huh? Yeah. Well, unfortunately, no. Last page was torn out. I'm telling you, Sully. This is it. This is finally it. Yeah. Only... We got one little problem. Yes, that's what I said. It blew up. It sank. No, that's why we have insurance, right? Oh. Oh, no, the camera? No, the camera's fine. Don't worry about the camera, no. Still as good as new. Sully, the girl can hold her own. You should have seen her. Fine. You go on out there and you tell her, we just found the lost city of gold. Maybe her producer can get it on the air tonight. Oh, come on. Nate, do you trust me? More or less. Good. Because we're going to have every two-bit scumbag in the world racing us to this treasure unless we cut her loose right now. You're a real gentleman, Sully. I know. It stinks. She'll get over it. No, I don't... I don't care for over-budget. I mean, do you realize that this could be, like... The biggest story of the year? <laughs> Hi. No, I don't trust him, okay? That's why we need to move fast. So just get me the camera crew, and I promise you that... Bitch. Hey! <sighs> Should have seen that one coming. Ugh. Hold on. Hold on, kid. I'm not as young as I used to be. <laughs> uh, yeah, you weren't too old for that little barmaid in Lima, were you? <laughs> well, that was different. Although, I must admit, equally as strenuous. <laughs> well, hang in there, old-timer. We're just about there. <laughs> you know, this reminds me. I ever tell you about the time I pawned a phony 16th century Santo off on Pablo Escobar? <laughs> uh, risky move, but by the time he figured it out, I was... Nate, are you even listening to me? Hanging on every word. Uh, why waste my
You really think Francis Drake came all the way up here, huh? We're an awful long way from England. Well, I don't get it. According to this, we're right on top of the mark. Maybe you're not reading that thing right. Let me see it. No, this is the place. There's nothing here, Nate. What a goddamn dead end. Easy, Sully. Just relax. Let's take a look around. Man, this is like trying to find a bride in a brothel. <laughs> Hell no. This is more like it. What do you think this is, Incan? Nah, it's older than that. Like 2,000 years older. Huh. <clears throat> Find anything? Nothing yet. Whoa! Oh, oh. Be careful up there. Hey, there's something funny about the ground down there. It's hollow. We gotta find a way to smash through this. Good work, kid. What a warm and homey place, huh? <laughs> well, not quite what you were expecting, huh? Yeah. Where's all the damn gold? Yeah, this place was picked clean centuries ago. No good limey pirate. No, it wasn't Drake. Check this out. Looks like the Spanish got here before he did. <laughs> what the hell, Sully? Nate, I'm not looking for a lousy piece of tin. I'm up to my eyeballs in debt. I was really counting on this one. Too many big bar tabs in Lima, I guess. <laughs> that and, well, just a few bad deals. Yeah, well, I always told you to stay away from the bad guys. And the bad girls. Yeah? Look who's talking. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? That reporter? I saw the way you were eyeing her. Elena? Please. I snuffed any chance with her the second we ditched her on that dock. <laughs> All's fair in love and war, kid. Uh, and what if you can't tell the difference? Then, my friend, you are in big trouble. Those Spaniards sure left a lot of crap behind. Careful, Nate. That's quite a drop. 
That'll work. Let me do that. I'll hold it open. See if you can jam it from the other side. All right, let go. This ought to hold it. Hurry, Sully! That was a little too close. Let's hope this place has a back door, huh? You know, this looks familiar. I think there's something in Drake's journal about this. Yeah, here it is. Looks like this thing is some kind of lamp or brazier. See if you can light it. So, after all your bitching about the cigar, now it comes in handy, huh? What do you make of this? Wait, I recognize these symbols. The order of these signs has some importance.
Pretty deep. Yeah, looks like there's a ladder cut into the side. Wait here while I check it out. All right, just be careful. Watch your step down there. Okay, getting somewhere. Tell me you're gonna swim in that. I've been in worse. I made it! I'm on the other side! Can you get this open? Nice one! I've got this one. This looks safe. like we're getting somewhere. After that, we better be. Oh, man. The temple must have been built around this. Around what? A statue. A gold statue. Huge gold statue. And look here, these people, they're worshipping the damn thing. At least, I think they're people. Of course. El Dorado, the golden man. Sully, it wasn't a city of gold. It was this. It was a golden idol. Man, can you imagine what that thing would be worth now? Look over here, tracks. I bet the Spanish dragged it out on cut logs. We're 400 years late for this party. So the trail's cold. Yeah, it looks that way. Son of a bitch. Unless... Unless what? We follow the tracks.
Huh. They stop here. Yeah, it looks like the back wall of the temple was blown out. Yeah. The Spaniards must have made themselves a shortcut to get the treasure out. Swell. Now what? Wait, Sully, do you hear that? Now there's something you don't see every day. My God. Check it out, huh? Yeah, uh, wait, wait, wait. Something about this feels kind of hinky. Hinky? You act like you've never seen a German U-boat in the middle of the jungle before. Uh, I'm being serious, Nate. I tell you what, why don't you stay here? I'll check it out myself. I'll call you if I run into any Nazis. Yeah, right. You do that. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on to this for me, will you? Okay. Looks like I'm gonna have to do this the hard way.
should be able to drop right down into the U-boat from there. Okay, I'm in. What do you see? Something nasty happened to these guys. There's blood everywhere. And soup. What? Get this, my decomposing friend. I think the trail just got warm again. How so? Well, I just met a guy with pockets full of Spanish gold. Only the coins are stamped with a mint mark I've never seen before. You're kidding me. Looks like our German friends had a little secret. Shreds, actually. Oof, what a way to go. Yeah, sounds terrible. Check his wallet. You're all hearts, Sully. You're not gonna believe this. Try me. I think I found our missing page. You're kidding. It looks like Drake and our German pals were after the same treasure. And I've got the map that's gonna lead us right to it. Nate, this better not be another wild goose chase. We've gotta get something out of this trip or... Or what? Sully? You there? Sullivan? Probably bad. Uh, 
Hello. Hey, hey. Friends of yours, Sully? I'm Gabriel Roman. Yeah, I know who you are, asshole. Manners, young man. This is just business. Get over there. Easy. Put your hands up. Hi, right, they're up. See, your friend owes me money, Mr. Drake. A lot of money. So when he told me that you two were onto something big, the find of a lifetime, he said, well, I was intrigued. But he's made grand promises before, haven't you, Victor? And here we are again. Another fool's errand. Jeez, does he always go on like this? Take it easy, Navarro. <laughs> so, I'm afraid the time is up. Unless, of course, you found something in there, Mr. Drake, that might compensate for all this unpleasantness. He's screwing with the innate. They heard everything. Just give him the map. Slowly. What does a Krieg's marine map have to do with El Dorado? What? You think this is a coincidence? The Germans were after the same treasure. That map has something to do with it. So? We square? For now. But just in case you need a reminder... Hey, come Ooh. on, leave him out of it. Yeah, don't you guys usually just cut off a finger or something? That's far too vulgar. No, I think this will hurt him a bit more. Now, whoa, whoa, whoa. Come on, Roman. He's got nothing to do with that. Sully! Sully! You son of a bitch! No luck, too, Robert. He went this way. I ran your head. Well, you're down to one tomb robber now. Sully's dead. What? Yeah. And we're next if we don't get out of here. Oh, God. I'm, I'm sorry. Please tell me you have a gun. Of course. Oh, thanks. All right, come on. Shot at. They're shooting at you too, you know. There he is. Stay close. What the hell is this place, anyway? Long story. Tell you later.
Never a dull moment, huh? Just keep your head down. These guys aren't messing around. Stay with me. Seem to attract the scum of the earth. Uh, uh, yeah, no offense. None taken. Do you have a good memory? Yeah, why? UK 2642. You got that? Yeah, what is it? It's Creek's Marine coordinates. I think I know where the Spanish took El Dorado. El Dorado? The problem is, so that the bastards killed Sully. Damn it! If the Spanish found the treasure, they had to move it there, to that island. And Drake followed them. Well, what are we waiting for? I'll get the story, and you get. Whatever it is you're after. Yeah. Come on. Hey, this isn't going to be a vacation, you know. I can take care of myself. Besides, you owe me one. I suppose I do. We're on the trail of the lost treasure of El Dorado, and it's brought us here to this tiny island in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. Let's get a closer look. I hope we're the first ones here. Will we discover the ruins of a forgotten colony and a fortune in Spanish gold? Or does the island have darker secrets in store for us? That should keep him from changing the channel. Whoa! What the hell was that? An anti-aircraft fire? This is so not cool! Oh crap! We're on fire! Enough with the damn camera! We gotta bail out! Bail out? Does this thing even have parachutes? Now would be a good time to look! Uh, I hope these things still work! We'll find out in a second. Have you ever done this before? Of course! You just jump, count to five, and pull the cord! Now go! Are you coming? I'm kind of busy right now. Get going. See you on the ground. Right behind you. Yeah. Ah, 
Ah, oh, shit. Strangers trying to kill me, leave my map on a burning plane. Plane is missing. Most likely dead. That's great. Great start, mate. Come.
me. Doesn't look good. Oh! 
Better watch where I'm going. Hang on, Elena. Ahead, don't look down. Don't look down. Can't be serious. Oh, no, wasn't I just out here?
No sign of her. It's either very good or very bad.
hell is she doing? Hello? Buka Pintu! See you later, Chipatan Buka Pintu. Ah, Tai. It worked. There he is. Up there. Get on the gun. Oh boy. You gotta be kidding. This place could use a good plumber. Son of a bitch, where'd they all come from? Come in here. 
perdí. Jesus, Elena, where are you? Hmm. Huh. Wait a minute. Now, what's so important about that tower? <clears throat> oh! Son of a bitch! Same symbol, but what's that got to do with the tower?
Excuse me. Thank you. Hell is she?
<clears throat> These aren't Spanish. They're English. Whoa. Fletcher, we have gone to the Great Tower. I pray that you will meet us there. Francis Drake. Wow. So you made it. But what were you plotting? Must be Drake's tower. she go? This must have been Drake's. So what were you looking for, huh? Well now, that looks familiar. Huh, the ship's never left. Elena! Hey, there she is. Crap. No! We got him. I know I'm not a big time treasure hunter like you, but I doubt you're gonna find El Dorado in there. How'd you get yourself in this mess? Trying to rescue you, as a matter of fact. Oh, that's so sweet. Traditional sandstone, brick, and stucco. Limestone mortar, huh? How'd you get to know so much about this? My show, Episode 4, Architects of a New World. Yep, it'll just take a tug to pull these bars out. What? No, wait, are you sure? Get out of my way, puto! Hey, Batman, open this goddamn door! Oh, crap. Hey, Drake. Daddy Raja. <laughs> I should have guessed. Fascinating document, huh? Seems like this Sir Francis was in my line of work. 
Don't flatter yourself, Eddie. <laughs> Always ready to be enemies, eh? <laughs> Tell you what. Lead me to the gold. And I just might let you live. <laughs> Is that it? Is that my deal? Die now, or help you, and die later. That's oh, a tough call, but you know what? I'll take die now. Die now? Listen to me, maggot. I was promised treasure on this goddamn rock. And now, my men are dying. They can't even go outside to take a piss without an armed guard. And I have nothing to show for it! I am making you a fair offer. You help me find the treasure. And the last man alive gets the gold. And the girl, of course. The girl? Oh, Eddie, the girl's long gone. She's probably off the island by now. Going for help. Dai Kuching, you were never very good at poker. I will find her. Trust me. How much trouble could one girl be? Nice work. Thanks. Uh, hey, hey, Hang on.
goes with the territory. Let's get the hell out of here. Damn it. Come on. <laughs> Going somewhere? Hey, Eddie. Did you really think you could escape from what? Oh, no. I just giving the young lady the $10 tour. Shut it. I bet you're working for them, too. What? You thought you could set me up and keep everything for yourselves, hmm? Get down! Damn it! This guy's crazy! Eddie, take it easy, buddy. <laughs> well, you're out of luck now! And out of room. Now. Give me that map. Hold on. All right, you got me. Fair and square. Hey, don't move. Relax, Eddie. Just get in the map like you asked. I said, hold on. I am. Well, hand it over. Well, now, you told me not to move. Looks like you're gonna have to come get it. I am. This was a big mistake. <laughs> no kidding. You know, I should have turned before the bridge. <sighs> That's very funny. Oh, come here a minute. I want to show you something. That thing still works? Uh-huh. Check this out. Okay, see this building in the harbor? That's where all the boats coming into the colony would have unloaded their cargo. So if the El Dorado treasure came to this island, it would have had to have come through here. Wait a minute, what? What was that? What? Rewind it. Yeah? Wait, stop. Uh-huh. Right there. That's our ticket out of here. Come on. Our ticket out of here? Are you giving up? Maybe you hadn't noticed, but we're kind of outnumbered. <laughs> we're doing fine so far. Elena, I don't need your bullet-riddled corpse on my conscience. Let's go. Oh, please. You quit if you want to, but don't use me as an excuse. <laughs> fine. It's me, okay? I am quitting. Are you coming or not? So that's it. You're just gonna forget about the treasure and forget about Drake? God damn it, this is not worth dying over. Okay. Okay. Listen, either way, we have to head back to the harbor. Don't worry about it. We can argue about it later. It'll be great. Wait.
This time, I drive. Okay. Company! Hit the barrel! Ow! What happened to this place? Whole city's completely flooded. I read a story once about a cursed Inca treasure. You don't suppose that... Please don't tell me you believe in that stuff. I'm just saying... Something bad happened here. The whole colony doesn't just up and vanish. <laughs> yeah. Well, how do you explain it? What? Uh, thanks. Looks like that cable would get us up there. Let's go check it out. I'll stay here and keep an eye on our ride. See if you can figure a way to get us to that tower. Great.
Gotta get to that tower. I'll meet you back at the customs house.
freaking kidding me. Another one. Oh, 
that had to hurt. Stand back! All right, let's find a way to the harbor and hope the boat's still there. Wow. These must be all the old ship manifests. <laughs> Still seem to be in good shape. <sighs> hey, check this out. This looks right. The Esperanza sailed from Cayo, Peru, carrying 800 bars of gold, 1,200 silver emeralds, golden masks, ornaments. Whoa, reading 16th century Spanish? Not just a grave robber after all, huh? Right here. Gold statue. Weight, 20 arrobas. That's over 500 pounds. That's gotta be it. Wow. There you are. That thing kinda gives me the creeps. Huh. That's the last entry. That somebody special? What? Oh. Uh, yeah. I guess you could say that. Huh. I had you pegged as more of a woman in every port kind of guy. <laughs> Don't I wish. No, this was, uh, this was Francis Drake's ring. I, you know, kind of inherited it. Sic parvis magna? Greatness from small beginnings. It was his motto. Check out the date. 29th of January, 1596. One day after he supposedly died. Wait, what are these numbers right here? Coordinates. Right off the coast of Panama. Oh, so that's how you found the coffin. Yeah, that's right. See, Drake left this as a clue to pinpoint the exact burial site. For someone clever enough to figure it out. <laughs> yeah, nice try. But we're still going for that boat. Yeah, I'm afraid this is as close as we're getting to El Dorado. Like we missed our chance. No, there it is. On the other side of the harbor. Come on. Hey, you know what? Why don't I just wait here and you can uh, swing around and come back and pick me up? <laughs> okay, what are you up to? 
Nothing. I just want to, you know, stay here and get some more footage. I'll be safe. All right, fine. But promise me you'll stay put. Whatever that means. Who's this now? Wait, that's not one of Eddie's. Here. You really need to see this. Now is really not the best time. No, Nate. What are you doing? You really need to watch this. Just... What? Don't forget to stop on the dock. And... Hello. He's alive. Huh. 
How much do you trust this guy? It's not exactly like they're holding them at gunpoint. I, I know. Yeah, it seems weird. But no, Sully's a lot of things, but he's not a backstabber. Which way were they headed? Uh, northish. Yeah, towards the mountains. Okay, it's gotta be the monastery. Let's go. Uh, what if it turns out he's working with them? We either rescue him, or we beat the crap out of him. Hell, I might just beat the crap out of him anyway. Shoot to kill! Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> See those scorch marks? Uh-huh. Somebody packed this place with enough gunpowder to blow it wide open. Ooh. Watch where you step. Some of these boards are really falling. <laughs> to take us right up to the monastery.
Let's head up to the monastery and see what's going on. Slow down. One of Eddie's goons could be up ahead. Come on, we left those clowns in the dust ages ago. Oh my god. That's disgusting. Oh, I wish I had my camera. So what? The Spanish booby trapped the island to protect their gold? This wasn't made by the Spanish. Take a closer look at the spikes. You have got to be kidding me. This is from our plane. Wait, that doesn't make any sense, though. Why would someone set traps like this when their own men are crawling all over the island? They wouldn't. Something's been here since a trap was sprung. Something or someone? Do you think Shh. that... Do you hear that? Hear what? Nothing. Absolutely. 
We're being watched. Watched? Yeah, you, you know what? It's probably nothing. Um... Let's just get out of here before we run into whatever's been chewing on this guy. Roman and Navarro can't be far off if they've left their attack dogs at the gate. Secure. Don't let them get to Sullivan. Yes, sir. They've got the old man working on the east side of the complex. I don't even know why they brought him along. That son of a bitch can't be trusted. a bad feeling about this place. I don't know, me too. Let's just find no. Sullivan and get the hell out of here. Yeah. <laughs> 
here. I'll hold that while you brace the gate open. <sighs> you ready? Okay, let it go. Gently! Ah, I said gently! That must be the library. Over there. But well, we're not gonna waltz right in the front door. Let's find another way in. Scope things out. She worked in this little bar in the Philippines. Oh, man. She had a smile that would melt your heart. Bro, I swear to God, she just as soon kill you as kiss you if she caught you stepping out. Just a wee bit of a thing. She couldn't have been much more than 4'11". They called her the spinner because she... Will you shut up, old man? You told us that one a dozen times already. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> of course I did. Memory's not what it used to be. What the hell's taking you so long anyway? Well, maybe you hadn't noticed, but most of these books are half rotten. And written in Spanish. Yeah, we'll hurry it up. The boss is waiting on you. Hey! Up there! Ah, oh, crap. Look out! Hey! You won't be so lucky this time! time you showed up well you're looking awfully good for a corpse so you brought the girl after all huh the girl hey if it wasn't for her you wouldn't be getting rescued right now if this is a rescue what the hell does that mean you gotta admit sully this all looks a little shady yeah i mean you tipping those guys off and miraculously showing up alive now wait a goddamn minute roman had a contract out on me i needed to buy some time all right, stupid mistake. I didn't realize they'd try and track us. Sully, we would have been headed home with the treasure by now if you had just for once kept your mouth shut. And you might have thought of checking for a pulse before running off and leaving me for dead. Look, none of that matters now. All right, so how is it you're standing here breathing and all, huh? <laughs> you are not going to believe this. Huh? huh? No way. <laughs> Old Francis took a bullet for you. Yeah. I thought this kind of thing only happened in the movies. Yeah, well, it still hurt like a son of a bitch, I'll tell you that. <laughs> I bet. Anyway, 
Once they realized I wasn't dead, I convinced Roman that they would never find the treasure without me. So I've been trying to mislead him ever since, waiting for you to show up. Well, where are they now? Well, they're chasing a little red herring I sent him on on the other side of the monastery to get rid of him. <laughs> Look. Drake had it all figured out. See, that's the symbol the Spanish used to mark their secret vaults. The treasure is hidden right here in this monastery. Find the symbol, and we, we find the vault. We have everything we need right here. All the clues to take us right to the treasure. We can do this, kid. <laughs> all right. You boys aren't going to get all chummy and leave the girl behind again, are you? <laughs> Don't even think about it, Sully. She's got a mean right hook. I'll keep that in mind. There's more to this room than meets the eye. I'm sure of it. Hmm. Something about these statues. Okay. No, that's not right. Bingo! <laughs> Another library? Huh. What now? You know, this looks familiar. The inverted torch leads to the land of the dead. Oh, <laughs> 
Promising. Here, let me see that. Yeah. Okay. You two sit tight. I'm gonna check things out. Whoa, 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 wait, no. You're not going out there alone. Yeah, Roman's men are swarming all over this place. Yeah, and one person will make a lot less noise than three. Come on, I'll be fine. And you guys will be safe here. They don't even know about this room. Okay, take this with you. Leave it on channel 13. They don't use that one. And keep us posted. All right, you got it. Close this thing back up. Yeah. Nate, be careful. <laughs> Come on. I always am. Ah! I did not see that! Ah! Okay, land of the dead. Here we go. There's something about this. Two bells resound in perfect harmony.
We got all the clues right here. We can do this, kid. How the hell does he think he's gonna get that statue out of here anyway? He's over there! Jeez, these guys are everywhere. There he is. This is completely unacceptable. What do you expect from me, Roman? My men are getting massacred! <laughs> I find it hard to believe that one man could wipe out your entire crew. Ugh, it's not just Drake, goddammit! I'm telling you, this island is cursed! Enough. Take your sorry mob and go. Wait, you can't cut me loose. You owe me a share of the gold! Your share, Eddie, was contingent upon you doing what I required. You assured me that Drake was captured and the island secure. Oh, this is bullshit, Roman, and you know it! We're done here, Mr. Roger. Dai Kamu! Matia Zello! Zellan! Remind me again why you employed that superstitious idiot? You wanted someone cheap. <laughs> well, you get what you pay for, I suppose. And what about you, Navarro? Are you worth what I'm paying you? The vault's here. I'm sure of it. If Sullivan can be trusted. Which he can't. Look, he knows we'll kill him if he's lying. Don't be stupid. He knows we'll kill him once we find the treasure. He has no incentive to tell the truth. Really, Navarro, sometimes I think you left your brains back in that slum where I found you. I just need a little more time. Chasing this treasure of yours is proving to be more trouble than it's probably worth. I assure you, El Dorado is worth more than you can possibly imagine. <laughs> it had better be.
Sully, I'm just going in circles here. Well, the girl and I have been reading some of the books down here, and it looks like there's some kind of secret gallery at the top of the church. Can you get there? I think so. Yeah. All right. Give us a call if you find anything. That's got to be it. Aha! Huh. Well, hello there. You gotta be kidding. <sighs> hey, Sully. I'm here. Remember Roman and Navarro? That red herring you sent them on to get them out of the way? Yeah. Well, they're sitting right on top of the treasure vault. Oh, of all the goddamn luck. Look, I'm gonna need a diversion to get them out of there. You got it, kid. One diversion. Coming right up. And Sully. Yeah? Once they're gone, meet me in the mausoleum. But come through the catacombs. It's safer that way. Gotcha. 
Now I've just got to get past all these goons without getting noticed. Sullivan has escaped. Spread out. Find him. Hey. Hey. <laughs> I knew you could do it, kid. So what's next? I don't know. I'm figuring it out as I go. This is definitely the right place, though. Wait a second. It's something to do with these symbols. Navarro really tore this place up. <clears throat> you sure we're in the right place? Looks like we're in business. Yeah, well, 
You better get back to the library. We're gonna have to find another way out of here. Well, there's no way but forward. Yeah. What is this place? A really elaborate way to hide the damn treasure. Which way do we go? Huh. Wait a second. There are Roman numerals on the corner of Drake's map. This has got to mean something. lost. <laughs> this has got to be good for something. Sully, you read me? Damn, nothing.
gate open. I'll wait here. What the hell? Even alive gets the gold. You lose. <laughs> Kill them both. This just keeps getting better and better. I think there's some kind of ladder mechanism up there.
<sighs> There's nothing here. This is getting so old. Nate? It's Drake. He never found it. He just died here. So much for greatness. Wasted his life. For nothing. Nate. Are you ready to get moving? Yeah. More than ever. There's gotta be a way out of here. It looks like there's some kind of machinery up there. Hey, there's a ladder. Here, I think I can reach it if you give me a boost. Come on. Now oh, you're heavier than you look. Can you reach it? Looks like an old hoist or something. There's a rope. I'll try to lower it down to you. Oh, I see a tunnel. We can get out this way. Hello, boys. <laughs> easy, Eddie, easy. What the hell's going on out there? Didn't you see them? Oh, no. Oh, God, no! We're trapped! Jesus, what is that? We're dead! We're all dead! Eddie, get back here! Oh, crap. Jake, if we don't make it out of here, I just want you to know, I hate your guts. Yeah, likewise, pal. Now let's do this.
Are you okay? Yeah. Nate? Okay. I don't think they can get through this. Nate. What? Where are we? I'm not sure. <gasps> Go! This explains the U-boat in the Amazon. Nate, come here, look at this. So they found it. They must have broken into the vault and cleared it out. Yeah, but what's the monastery got to do with it? I, I don't know. It doesn't make any sense. Huh. If that's where the statue is now... Oh man, we, we were right on top of it. I bet this will take us to the surface. Guess the Nazis didn't pay their electric bill. Oh, damn it! You know, I bet if we can make it to the generator room, we could get the power turned back on. We just gotta find a way out of here first. Wait, what are you doing? What are you doing? Found a way out. Nice work. Yeah. All right, let's go. Nope. This one's all you, cowboy. What do you mean? Nate, you know I can't make that jump. There is no way I'm leaving you here alone with those we things. We don't have a choice. Just go turn the power on, come back and get me, and then we'll get the hell out of here, okay? Just go. I will be right back. Yeah. Sullivan, come in. Hey, come in there. Nah, it's no use. I can't get a signal in here. here. Yeah. <sighs> 
This has got to be the generator room. to be a really lousy day. Oh, man. Those things must have got to them. How am I gonna get out of here? been murdered, leaving the task to me alone. No ship will depart this island. I destroyed them all and drowned the cursed city. A thing of such great evil must never leave these shores. In my final hour, I commend my soul to God. May he have mercy on this unholy place. Francis Drake. Not again.
Can you hear me in there? Loud and clear, jackass. Oh, no microphone on your end. What a shame. Uh, Nate, get out of there before... Uh, Elena! Leave her alone! <coughs> Navarro, if you can't maintain control over a small girl, it won't happen again. <coughs> Trust me. I'm sorry for the interruption. I just wanted to, uh, thank you for leading us to El Dorado. Of course. Oh, I hope you don't mind if we borrow Miss Fisher a little while longer, mm. just to discourage you and your partner from trying anything creative. So long, Nate. It's been fun. Yeah. Keep smiling, asshole. I'll see you soon. <sighs> oh, hell, that can't be good. You <sighs> go, Sully, are you there? Damn it. Sully, come in. Oh, thank God, mate. Where are you? Heading your way. They've got Elena. We have to stop them. Yeah, got problems of my own. 
Bastards have me pinned down outside the church. Almost there. Sully. They don't know what they're dealing with. What are you... I don't know how, but that statue destroyed the whole colony, and it killed the Germans, too. Whoa, whoa, come again? There's no time. We've got to get to the church.
on, Sully. There should be a hidden passage right under the altar. Drake didn't want to get the treasure off the island, Sully. He was trying to stop it from leaving. What? It's cursed or something. Oh, Nate, for God's sake. Look, I know it sounds crazy. You just gotta trust me. should realize by now that I plan for every contingency. Now drop your weapons. Down there. No heroics, please. Or I will kill her. Good. Now, if you'll just hang tight, we'll be with you in a moment. It's magnificent. Craftsmanship. I've never seen anything like it before. That is only a shell. The real treasure of El Dorado lies inside. <laughs> Open it! person on this island who knows what the hell he's doing. Gotta get lost that one. Cuidado! You are so pathetic. All of you, scrambling around for your petty treasures. Do you have any idea what this is worth? To the right buyer? Levantalo!
Nowhere to hide now! Elena! Save the world, triumph over evil. <laughs> Pretty typical. <laughs> really? <laughs> That's a shame we're leaving empty-handed, though. Oh, well, you know, I, I did manage to save one small thing. Here, I, I thought you might miss this. Thanks. Yeah. You two got a funny idea of romantic. Sully! Wow, you... you look like hell. You should see the other guys. <laughs> Got us a boat. Uh, we already have a boat. Yeah, big boat. <laughs> <laughs> I like this one better. <gasps> ah, ah, ah. Sully, you beautiful son of a bitch! Borrowed it off a couple of pirates who were too dead to care. <laughs> Sorry you didn't get your story. Well, that's all right. Now the other stories. You still own me one. I'm good for it.
Buy me a drink, sailor. Harry Flynn? Hey! What the hell are you doing here? I'm looking for you, mate. Uh-oh. Should I be flattered or worried? Maybe a bit of both. <laughs> Come here. I've got a job for us. Really? A client is willing to part with a huge sum of cash if we acquire a certain object for him. All right, I'm listening. Now, you're not gonna like this. Oh, no. No, you're out of your mind. Yeah, you just, just hear me out for no, a second. Flynn, we both know two people who were killed trying to lift something out of this and place. And one who made it out. Yeah, barely. I can't do this without you, Drake. You're the only one who's cracked it, and you know better than anyone it's a two-person job. No, no, no. Three, actually. Right. And speak of the devil, here she comes now. What? Chloe Fraser. Nate. Drake. Nathan. Drake. Hello, Harry. Chloe here's one of the best drivers in the business. She'll take good care of us. I bet. Right, look. I've got it all figured out. We go in through the sewer. I'm loving it so far. That puts us in the courtyard. From there, we scale up the wall, run across the rooftops, and just drop down into the exhibit hall. Bob's your uncle. And what is worth all this trouble, I hear you ask? I didn't, but go ahead. <laughs> But that's it. An oil lamp. Yeah. <laughs> it's worthless. I don't get it. Neither do we. That's why we tracked you down. Well, it sounds like you're working for a nutcase. Hmm. Some collector who's got too much time and money on his hands. And by the way, this is not worth any of it. But there's more. How's your 13th century Latin, mate? Where'd you get this? Borrowed it from the files of the nutcase. <laughs> In Trebizond, we were set upon by thieves. Father, Maffeo, and I were robbed of our greatest treasures. This was written by Marco Polo. Yes, that much we were able to work out. Unfortunately, the rest of it's nonsense. Hey, hold on. So that it should not fall into the wrong hands, I concealed my great sorrow in the unlikeliest place. The light of the great Khan shelters the fate of the Thirteen. See what I mean? It's just gibberish. He's talking about the Lost Fleet. Yeah. 
I don't know, someone want to fill me in? Marco Polo leaves China with 600 passengers and 14 ships loaded down with treasure from Kublai Khan. And he lands in Persia a year and a half later with only one ship left and only 18 passengers. Now, he recorded every detail of his journey, but he never told what happened to all those ships and the passengers. So, so somewhere out there, there are 13 ships loaded with the Emperor's treasure waiting to be found. Yeah, and that is what your client is after. Hey, look at this lamp. It's covered in Mongolian script. It must have been a gift from Kublai Khan. The light of the great Khan shelters the, the fate, fate of, of the 13. 13. Marco Polo hid something inside this lamp. Something that pinpoints the site of the lost fleet. So... We're dicking this guy over, right? Damn straight. Absolutely. <laughs> you in then? What the hell? I mean, what could possibly go wrong? <laughs> Is a bitch. Hello. Uh, <clears throat> well, so much for foreplay. You mind telling me what the hell is going on? You mean with Flynn? Yeah, you might have warned me. And missed the look on your face? Anyway, you haven't exactly made yourself easy to find. Talk about making yourself easy. Oh, you're not jealous. Let's not forget who walked out on whom. After all, you don't get to be jealous. Wait a minute, Chloe. If it makes you feel any better, my relationship with Flynn is strictly professional. Really? Mostly professional. Oh. When I figured out he was actually on to something, I thought you'd want to be in on the action. So what's the plan? Just like we said, we pull the heist. 
We find the ships and we make off with the treasure. With Flynn? Mm-hmm. And then? And then we split the take three ways and you and I just disappear. Together, this time. I see. Until then, he can't know about us. He's... up for this. I'd feel a lot better if I had a gun. We won't need them. A little insurance, that's all. Flynn, they're just museum guards. And we have their patrols all mapped out. Relax. Relax. <laughs> Relax. Have you ever been in a Turkish prison, mate? If we get caught, they will lock us up and throw away the sodding key. You do realize that, don't you? <laughs> better than you do. Well, you may fancy that kind of thing, but I don't. <laughs> Can't afford to make any mistakes. Yeah, and we won't. We're here. if they switch the patrols. Figure it out as we go. We cannot fumble our way through this. I don't fumble, I improvise. Oh, is that what you call it? Yeah, I'm uh, adaptable. Adaptable? You cocky bastard. <laughs> there. What did I tell you? That passage there is gonna take us right under the museum. <laughs> you called it all right. You need to have a little more faith in me, chum. <laughs> okay, this one here is me. All right, remember, that tower is our only way into the exhibit. But we can't even get close with those floodlights on. We've gone over this. Just make sure you cut the power by the time we reach the second courtyard. The lights will be out. I'll have the van waiting at the rendezvous point. Just make sure you get your asses out of there in time. Fair enough. All right, enough chat. Let's do this. <sighs> Chloe. I'll see you on the other side. Looking forward to it. You sure you know where you're going? Don't I always? Don't you love the way the water makes your jeans all squidgy? It's like the good old days, isn't it? Yeah. 
When were those again? Oh, wait. This can't be right. We must have made a wrong turn somewhere. <laughs> hey, now what do you bet that will take us right into the boiler room? And from there, we're in. Yeah, <laughs> in like Flynn, right? What? In like Flynn. I don't get it. Just give me a boost. Here it comes. Thanks. Almost there. You ready? No guts, no glory. Here we go. We're good. Reach up there and grab the ladder. Okay, I'm on. Yeah. Yeah, I dropped it down for you. All right. This is the way to the courtyard. Well. We're not going this way. Not if you want to keep your skin. All right. There's got to be a shutoff valve around here somewhere. See if you can find it then. You got it. Okay, now there should be a door just around this corner. That's our access point. Once we're through, just stick to the plan. You got me? Tell me you didn't miss this. I'm here, aren't I? It's locked. Good job I came prepared. <laughs> I pick more than my nose, my friend. Wait! There's an alarm. Oh, that's new since last time. Ah, great. Now what? Well, I can disarm it if we can find the junction box. It's gotta be around here somewhere. I got him. Night, night. There's the tower. Yeah, but we can only get to it from the roof, and we can't get to the roof from here. We're gonna have to make our way to the next courtyard, through that gate over there. Well, let's do it. <clears throat> Wait. 
We've got to get up to that balcony. We can climb the gate over here. Got it. Gece vardiyasında çalışmaktan nefret ediyor. I've got the other one. Haklısın abi. Hiçbir şey olmuyor. Bazen o. Sleep tight. Vardiyan ne zaman bitiyor? Daha çok var. 15 dakikaya kadar bitiyor. Come on, what are you waiting for? Okay, we're almost there. I'll go right, you go left. Orda! Yabancı. Yakaladık onu. Bütün bağlanı arayın. Okay, we're almost there. I'll go right, you go left. Orası. Okay, we're almost there. I'll go right, you go left. Huh? Sleep tight. Sweet dreams. Okay, we should be able to lift this up, sneak right under. Whoa, whoa, not so fast. There's another alarm. Oh, great. You want to get this one? Wait here. this courtyard to get onto the roof. Okay, I'll just let you do all the asking, all right? Right. Head for the fountain. Selam Hakan. Bu gece nasılsın? Yorgunum. Bir an önce eve gitmek istiyorum. Lights out.
lights out. Transfer olmamış mıydı? Now we just gotta find a way up to that window. Which window? There's a lot of bloody windows. to tip the odds back in our favor. Oh, that's brilliant. Guns? What are you thinking? Relax, Gandhi. They're tranquilizer guns, totally non-lethal. Your conscience will remain unscathed. Oh, well, good idea. Great. OK, a little bit of advice. These things have lousy range, so we still have to get in close. You OK with that? I know how to shoot a gun, genius. Bu kutulara bizim taşımamızı beklemiyorlar umarım. Bu bizim görevimiz değil ki. Bunlar ne ki zaten? Eski sergi. Ortaya. We gotta get up to that walkway. This could help. Okay, for something with wheels, this is very heavy. There, that'll work. Now all we need is a horse. Those rafters will get us onto the roof. If we can get Good up thing there. one of us thought ahead, eh? Thanks, mate. Come on. All right, all right. I'm coming. I think I'm going to take the elevator next time. All right, there's the tower. Getting closer. Appreciate that update, Captain Obvious. Don't look down. Don't look 
down, 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 down. Mehmet'e ne oldu? O mu? O artık gündüz vardiyasında çalışıyor. Memnun muymuş? Mutluymuş öyle dedi. Ama ben kişisel olarak turistlerle muhatap olmak istemem. <gülüyor> 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 Shit, that was close. Ooh. All right, no more donuts for you. Okay, I can get this. Yeah. Ah, once again, you're up. As always. There's a guy above you, there's a guy above you. <gasps> Sweet dreams. There's a guy below you, there's a guy below you. See your house. Let's get moving. Can't get any closer with the tower lit up like that. What the hell is she doing? Come on, Chloe. <laughs> That's my girl. Ladies first. Ah, <laughs> cute. Here we go. Oh, there it is. And there's the acoustic alarm. Until we get this case unlocked, that thing's gonna go off if we so much as touch this glass. No worries, mate. Voila. <laughs> All right. Now we're sure it's the right one. I guess there's only one way to find out. Sorry, Marco. Statement of the year. This is it. It's bloody useless. The light of the great Khan. Wait a minute. What are you doing? It's resin. It'll burn. And? Just give me your lighter. What? Is that really a good idea in here? And? Let me see that. Our ships were driven by a great flood tide into the wilds of Java. Sounds like they were hit by a tsunami. 
Yeah, somewhere off the west coast of Borneo. Oh, great. That narrows it down a bit. Uh, look, this mountain must have been the closest landmark where they went aground. We find that mountain. We find the ships. Yeah, good work, mate. Uh, wait, wait, there's more. Okay, Joe. As if the ocean itself sought to throw off the terrible cargo we carried from Shembala. The curse of the Chintamani. Would that mean something to you? Shambhala? Oh my god, Flynn. What? Marco Polo found Shambhala. Shangri-La. You're joking. If they were carrying the Chintamani stone, it might still be there. It's all very fascinating, but we really gotta go. Yeah, I'm right behind you. What the hell are you doing? Sorry, mate. This is where we part ways. Wait, Flynn, we had a plan. No, you had a plan. Turns out I've got one of my own. Uh, come on, throw me the rope. Don't be stupid. Oh, yeah, right. You're the mastermind. Only you overlooked one little detail. Didn't you, partner? So what are you gonna do, shoot me now? No, I just need you out of the way for a little while. <laughs> You think I didn't know about the ships from the beginning? Any schoolboy could have figured that out. Flynn, listen. Face it, genius. You've been played. Ah, <laughs> uh -uh, not yet. Want to give the guards a decent head start. Right, that's my cue. No hard feelings, yeah? Damn it, Flynn. How much you can cup of it? Cup of your cup of it? No, 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 no. Okay, now I'm screwed. All right, all right. Think, Nate, think. Hey, Nate, yeah, there it is. Burda. Yeah, this way, this way. Right. Use your head. Use your head. You can die. I get out of here. Just use the There we go. Got to get to that ladder. <laughs> See ya, suckers. You overlooked one little detail, didn't you, partner? What? Face it, genius, you've been played. Oh, really? Hey, hey, hey! Jackass, you're ruining the show here. Ah, oh, what a shame. Sully! I really can't leave you alone for a minute. Oh, man, am I glad to see you. How you doing, kid? Uh, I'm doing just great. So, had to grease a few palms. Did go through the rest of your money. And a good chunk of my own, but... Hey. <laughs> Jesus, you stink. Yeah, not half as bad as that cigar. Yeah. Hey, how'd you find me? Well, uh... Friend of yours asked for my help. Hello, Nate. Oh, no. No. Now, wait a second. Sully, kick her out and shut the door. We're safer in here. Just wait a goddamn minute. Hear her out. Thank you, Victor. Hey, no offense, Sully, but you're not exactly the best judge of character, especially when it comes to women. Fair enough. All the same. Dear God. Oh, no, it's not that bad. Look, I have my own bucket. Mm. Last cell I was in, eight of us had to share. Listen, Nate. You know something I really appreciate you dropping by? But if you and Flynn hadn't screwed me over in the first now, place, I wouldn't have been rotting in this shithole for Listen, the last three Nate. months. So excuse me if I'm not just, you know, leaping into your arms. I had nothing to do with it. Right. I told you, he's not going to listen to me. Screw this. Nate, they found the ships. In Borneo. Yes. And the Chintamani stone? How do you know about that? Do you really think Flynn could have figured that out on his own? All right, good point. 
No, they haven't found it yet. What do you mean, they? Flynn and his client, Bazarovich. You know, the nutcase. They've been working together all along. All right, then. If they haven't found the stone, that means there's still time. You're gonna get us into that dig site. We are gonna snatch that treasure right out from under them. They'll never see it coming. Yeah, well, payback's a bitch. Look, they called it the wish-fulfilling jewel. It's a sacred object. What, like a Buddhist holy grail? Exactly. Thanks. Sully, listen to this. In the kingdom of Shambhala lies the most precious thing to be found in all the world. A perfect raw sapphire of the deepest blue, larger around than the reach of a man's arms. Ooh, that's got to be worth millions. Hundreds of millions. And you say there's more of this? Loads more. Lazarevich paid top dollar for Marco Polo's journals. He's been after the Chintamani stone for years. <laughs> well, if he's been counting on Flynn to find it for him, it's no wonder he hasn't had any luck. <laughs> if I can get a look at Lazarevich's files, I can find that stone. Uh, hang on a minute, cowboy. That's easier said than done. The files are in his tent, and his tent is in the middle of the camp. It's like an armed compound. There are soldiers everywhere. Well, that's why it has to be a inside job from someone they know and trust oh okay i see where this is going I just need a diversion you give me five minutes in that tent that's all it'll take really five minutes well that's great i won't even have to get my top off chloe i was thinking more like an explosion or that can be arranged are you in oh hell yes i was in before you were You're reading us? Loud and clear. We're getting close. <clears throat> okay, I've planted charges all around the perimeter of the camp. You two just need to arm them. The first one should be right ahead of you. Here it is. I also left the detonator for you. Uh huh. There we are. All right. First one set. Don't touch the button. This one? <laughs> Once you've set all the charges, just hit the detonator and it's showtime. <laughs> They'll never know what hit them. Just be careful. The Zarevich has got his men posted all around the perimeter. Keep an eye out for patrols. I'm sweating like a hooker in church. You brought a hooker to church? Why not? Hey, careful. Finds what he's looking. Up ahead. Don't let him spot you. Let's take these guys out. Quietly. My feet haven't been dry for a month. Don't let Lazarevich hear you complaining like that. I said quietly. That's the other end of loud. <laughs> Looks like we can swing across there. <laughs> Maybe you can. All right, hold on, Grandpa. See if I can find another way up. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> 
Hands up! Ah, perfect. Thanks, kid. This way. Nate, you should be approaching excavation site one by now. Intruder! Shit, we've been spotted. Take them out fast. We can't let them slip one out. charges in there, but you're going to have to clear the place out before you can arm them. Here's the camp. You ready for this? Let's do it. What else does he expect to find? Don't let Lazarevich hear you talking like that. Still got arm three of the charges. There should be only two left. All right, one more and we're out of here. Okay, that's all of them. Now let's go pay Mr. Lazarevich a visit. Can't reach us. Come on over here, I'll give you a boost. All right. Come on, gorgeous, jump up. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You got a great ass, Sully. Uh, thanks. 
Here you go, kid. All right. Ooh, that must have been some tsunami to wash these ships so far inland. Get down! Shit. The pop is down again. Ah, uh, the damn thing is always breaking down. Come on, let's just fix it so we can get out of here. Look, they're not armed. Well, not that many. What are we waiting for? We can take these guys. I don't know, Sully. So maybe. Uh! <laughs> You always follow the hose. Just like in Montreal, huh? You're never gonna forget that, are you? I think I see the camp up ahead. Okay, you ready? Wait, wait, just hold on a sec. Three months, and you have found nothing. Well, well, well now, wait, wait a minute. We've been... Commander! That must be Lazarevich. This man was caught stealing artifacts from site number five. <laughs> you would betray me for this? No, no, Zoran, I can't explain. No, no need, no need. Ah! I am surrounded by traitors and fools! What do you say we really ruin this guy's day? Do it. Run out! Search the perimeter! Go! Alright, it's all yours, kid. I'll cover you from here. <laughs> Some fool left a sniper rifle up here. Careful, Nate. Looks like they left a couple of sentries behind. Okay, kid. It's showtime. Nice. He's not paying us enough of this shit. Shut up with you. I'm sick of your complaining. Lazarevich guy isn't screwing around, Sully. You should see all this stuff. He's got files on every expedition to find Shambhala. All the way back to the 1600s. What about Marco Polo's journals? <laughs> Here they are. Just hurry it up. You haven't got much time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The worthy pilgrim is granted a golden passport to conquer obstacles on his journey to Shambhala. Huh. Is that supposed to mean something? Beats me. Hold on. Here we go. It was with great sorrow that I left my fellow travelers to their fate. A fate decreed by the dreadful cargo we bore from Shambhala. 
Must have thought that tsunami was some kind of divine retribution. Wait a minute. Damn. Sully, I don't think the Chintamani Stone is here. What? Listen to this. I, I would have sooner endured the wrath of Kublai Khan himself than remove the Chintamani Stone from that sacred shrine. Marco Polo never had the stone. Then what dreadful cargo was he talking about? I don't know. Well, if the stone's not here, what the hell is Lazarovich looking for? Shambhala. Here in Borneo? He's a little wide of the mark, don't you think? He must be trying to pick up Marco Polo's trail. Back to Shambhala. Why? <laughs> because the stone is still there. <sighs> Chloe, can you talk? Hold on. Yeah, I'm here. In all this digging they've done, have they found any bodies, any remains at all? No, now that you mention it, nothing. Why? <laughs> Over 600 people were shipwrecked here, yet there's no bodies. Don't you find that a little odd? So where did they all go? Where would you go if a tsunami hit? To higher ground. Bingo. We head to that mountain. What do you bet we find Marco's pals? Chloe, can you meet up with us? Already on my way. Great. Uh-oh. Nate, you gotta get out of there. You're gonna have to give me a minute, Sully. You don't have a minute. What's this? They're all dead. Oh, crap. Stay down, kid. I got you covered. Nate. Well, that's convenient. Gotcha, Sully. Should be this way. Oh, 
Sully. Look at these stones. Ah, now we're getting to somewhere. <laughs> Would you look at that? Oh, yeah. Hey. Hello. What do we have here? With any luck, the last resting place of Marco Polo's crew. Shall we check it out? Wow, this place must be thousands of years old. At least. Down this way. Wow. Looks like we hit the jackpot. Ugh, there must be hundreds of bodies down here. Look at their teeth. They're all black. I think they're all that way. They must have taken refuge. Oh! Hey, I think I found something. In here. What? They must have carried their cargo all the way up here after they were shipwrecked. More resin. I've seen this before. Sully, give me a light. Oh. Ooh. Wait a minute. This is blood. It's everywhere. Looks like a real massacre. All right, let's follow the blood stains. We'll see if they lead somewhere. Stand at this wall. Yeah, that's odd. This moves a little. Sully, help me out. Go again with the pushing. I think I hurt myself. The trail leads in here. Oh man, more bodies. Oh my God. You know, maybe I'm crazy, but it looks like they all killed each other. Come on, Nate. You're just getting spooked. Wow. Look at this. What do we have here? Careful. Kidding. Nate, you're gonna give me a goddamn heart attack. Oh. Man, is that an ugly friggin' thing? What is it? Some kind of weapon? No, no, it's a, a purba. It's a ritual object from Tibet. It's used to destroy obstacles. Huh? No, you know, spiritual ones. Oh. Wait a minute. Wait, could this be what Marco Polo was talking about? Kid, I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. <laughs> In his journal, he wrote that uh, the worthy seeker would be given a golden passport to conquer obstacles on the journey to Shambhala. So, what, this is it? Look, that's all really interesting, but where the hell is it a passport to? Well, maybe this map would help. Let me see that. <laughs> Between Greater India and the province of Tibet lies a field of exquisitely finished temples. Hundreds of gilded spires stretching as far as the eye can see. Hold on, I know this place. It's in Nepal. Yeah, except it's not just a field of temples anymore. It's a city. Well, that could make things a little more challenging. Now, hold on, there's more. 
In all these many temples, only one conceals the secret path to Shambhala. And that path shall only be revealed to the pilgrim who bears the golden passport. Oh, right. <laughs> nice work, kid. So what are we waiting for? <laughs> Let's get out of here. All right. See ya. Let's get going. I'm going to go out and make sure the coast is clear. I'll see you in a bit. Should have known it was you. <laughs> and you, Victor, goddamn Sullivan. You still dragging this tired old sack of shit around? Easy, Nate. That's pretty ballsy for a guy who spent the last three months behind bars. Better than pissing away three months in the jungle without a clue. Found the ships, though, didn't I? You couldn't find your own ass with both hands. And a map. They came from down there. Whoa. Harry, look at this. Speaking of maps... Between India and Tibet... One temple will reveal a pathway path to Shambhala. Jesus, Flynn, while we're young. Oh, no. Don't be such a bad sport. Take them to Lazarevich. You're gonna wish you'd stayed in prison, mate. Move. Keep moving! Ah, oh, shit! Are you all right? Yeah, well, it'll make it look more believable. Now I'm gonna try and buy you some time. No, Chloe, you have to come with us. No. Just meet me in Nepal. Now run. Let's go. I like her. Yeah, I bet you do. They've spotted us! Run for it! Watch it! What the hell? Thanks for the heads up! Will you quit screwing around to get up here? Let's go! Take them out! Run! Now what do we do? We jump? <laughs> Hold on there, son bitch. You gotta be out of your mind. We'll break our goddamn necks. Yeah, we get caught, Lazarevich will break them for us. I'm getting too old for this bullshit. Oh, come on, now don't you start this again. Listen, I don't have your luck. Guys like me gotta know when to walk away from the table. Sully, we're gonna get out of this, okay? We always do. Yeah. You go meet your girl in Nepal. I'm going somewhere warm. Come on. Hey. You can tell me all about it when you get back. There they are! Oh, shit. Well, shall we? After you, Butch. See you in hell, kid! You said Lazarevich had a head start on us. You weren't kidding. Well, he's had some help from the local guerrillas. The city's been on the brink of civil war for years. He just needed to throw a little gasoline on the fire. Charming. Yeah, well, all the chaos provides some cover while he destroys the city looking for the right temple. Nate? Hello? Yeah, I'm still here. You're not having second thoughts, are you? Oh, me? Never. 
Good, because I'm so ready to be done with these clowns. You got a map? Uh, yeah. I'll meet you in the old market. Things are pretty quiet over there. All right, you got it. Uh-oh. We got company. Oh, great. Can you lose them? I think it might be too late for that. Come on. Nate, are you all right? I've been better. This way. Find him. Crap. <clears throat> go, go, go. He's here somewhere. Keep your eyes open. <laughs> Okay, now we just gotta find Chloe. Parking job.
Seems like I am always saving your ass. Well, it is an ass worth saving. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Is that an ancient Tibetan ritual dagger in your pocket? Oh, maybe I'm just happy to see you. Hmm. <sighs> yeah, hello. So this is the key to everything. Yes, it is. Marco Polo's passport to Shambhala. What do we do with it? Ah! <laughs> I have no idea, actually. I do know Lazarevich won't get very far without it. I wouldn't underestimate him, you know. He and Flynn have been tearing this city apart. They must have leveled dozens of temples already. So what's our next move? Nate? Oh, I hate it when you do that. <laughs> Check this out. You see the symbol? Yeah. Look up there. Okay, I see the resemblance, so what does it mean? It means we know how Marco Polo found his next clue. The temple we're looking for is gonna be marked with this emblem. Now all we have to do is find it. <laughs> you do realize there are literally hundreds of these temples throughout the city. Yes, but if we found a higher vantage point... We could spot our needle in the haystack. Right. There's a hotel not far from here. <laughs> Chloe, now is not the time. It's easily the tallest building in the city. Right. Right. Well, okay. That's, uh, that's good thinking. Follow me. Yep. It's no good. It's locked. Wait here. I'll see if I can find a way around. Hey, I can see the hotel from up here. Yeah, I know. We're almost there. Stand back! Damn! Boy, it's a shame you have to sit on something that pretty. Here you go. Don't say I never do anything for you.
Come on, this way. Go. Okay. Any day now. Just don't want to get a spin up. That was chivalrous, huh? Yeah, it's not dead. You just gotta ask for it. Doesn't look like things are going too well for the resistance. I don't like these odds. No? No, I think maybe we should cut over to the hotel a different way. Just avoid this crew altogether. I'm sorry, do you have a plan to go along with that grenade? Yes, I do. I'm gonna circle around this way. Break up their little party. Aren't you forgetting about somebody? Well, that's where you come in, sweetheart. I need you to take care of him. But uh, do it quietly. Do it quietly? Yeah. Are you sure about this? Desperate times, right? What does that mean? I think that's the last of them. Well, this is a hotel. Now we just have to find a way up. I think this is our best bet. Give me a boost up. You got it. Okay. You got it? Yep. Right. Looks clear so far. Is there another way in? Not from here. <laughs> Very resourceful. I'm in. Oh, crap. Coming at you.
This way. Oh, that was unpleasant. You must have hit a generator. Give me a hand. Just a little more. Nate, move! It's no good. I'm gonna have to fix the power to get you out. You gonna be okay? Yeah, I wish I'd brought something to read. Looks like the circuit breaker's on the top floor. Just sit tight, I'll take care of it. Great. Power's out and the girl's trapped. I swear to God, if there's a zombie around the next corner... Ah! I see him. <laughs> <laughs> Forgotten about me, have you? Found it. Oh, God. Almost there. Come on. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh my god. Almost there. Come on. Up she goes. Oh, I think you're liking this a bit too much. <laughs> hey, check it out. Marco. Really? Come on. No. Fish out of water. You are so unprofessional. Well, here we are. Now we just gotta find the right temple. Well, that may be easier said than done. No, tell me about it. Maybe we can... Oh, bingo. There it is. That's the one. Yeah, it's gotta be. The one in the middle of all the gunfire and explosions. Lucky us. Nate, that's right where Lazarevich is camped. I was hoping we'd be headed in the opposite direction. Well, desperate times, right? Drake has been spotted in Sector 18. Oh, crap. Any chance this is Sector 19? Sweep the city, find him, and take him out. Son of a bitch. All right, time to go. Come on, Nate, let's get moving! Damn it. How the hell do we get across? Oh god, be careful. Holy shit. Ah! Here, I've got you. Give me your hand. Just go! Don't stop! Ah! <laughs> What the hell are they doing? This 
isn't good. Was in that. <laughs> this way, come on. Guess we caught this hotel in the down season, huh? <sighs> come on. Bridge. Sweet. Yeah, tell me about it. The resistance fighters built them to get across the rooftops. Yeah, lucky for us. Lower the bridge. That wire. That's our way down. Go, go. All right, all right. Hey, hey, don't you... Hey! <sighs> Nate? What the hell are you doing here? <gasps> Jeff, don't! <sighs> Wait, you know this guy? Yeah. This is Drake. Oh. Sorry. 
So, what's your angle on all this misery? You gonna plunder a few temples, loot the museum? Yeah, it's nice to see you two. I suppose you're here for some noble crusade, right? Actually, we're trailing a fugitive war criminal. Zoran Lazarevich, have you heard of him? Isn't that NATO's job? Well, they think that he's dead. Killed in some bombing raid. Oh, and you're here to prove otherwise. You know what? This guy's a real monster, Nate. We're talking torture, mutilation, mass executions. See, now he's he's plotting something new. But why out here? Why why tear apart the city, you know? It just doesn't make any sense. Oh. What? Now, tell me you don't have anything to do with this. <laughs> That's ridiculous. There you are, Nate. I think I lost them. Oh, whoa, whoa. It's all right, Chloe. They're journalists. Oh. Oh. We need to keep moving if we want to stay one step ahead of Lazarevich, so... Oh, man, Nate. Uh, hey, wait, wait, wait. Now, don't jump to conclusions, Elena. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm sorry. Am I sensing some history here? Oh, Elena Fisher. Last year's model. <laughs> That's cute. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> no, no. I'm glad you find this so funny. Well, it's just, I never figured you for the white bread picket fence type. Hey, she's a lot tougher than she looks, thank you. <sighs> oh. Oh, what? She broke your heart. Oh, please. <laughs> she did. Hey, you know what? She? Maybe I broke hers. Oh, yes, Casanova. We need to get moving. Uh, wait. Um, they're coming with us. Can't be serious. Uh, yeah, I am. I mean, I can't just ditch him in the middle of this mess. They're only going to slow us down, and if uh, we Chloe, get, if Lazarevich catches you and me together, I'm not leaving them behind. You don't always have to play the bloody hero, you know. Nate, just dance with the one who brought you, all right? Yeah, I get it. But they're still coming with us. Oh, well, we don't need saving, Nate. Thank you. <laughs> You might want to rethink that. Shit. Run! Yeah, come on! Look out! Oh, what's next? You think you do this? I don't ask for this trouble. Pretty good shot for a journalist. I've had some practice. Just keep moving. Help me with this door. On three. One, two, three. That's it. Thanks. Great. How are we going to get across? There's a ladder on the far side. Maybe we should swim across. Current's too strong. We'll never make it. Go on, boost you up.
They're everywhere! Let's get down! Let's take out that gun! We'll distract them! You see if you can flank them! clear is it always like this with him pretty, pretty much. much see anything up there come on this way those are resistance fighters to hurry. All right. We should be safe in here. Oh. Cool. that, huh? You brought us right to the doorstep. <laughs> so I'm guessing it's not a coincidence that we ended up here? Uh, no, not exactly. <laughs> God, you're an ass. Okay, just what is it you're after, anyway? See that symbol up there? It's called the Chintamani Stone. Nate? It's a massive raw sapphire. It's worth millions. So let me get this straight. You're competing with a psychopathic war criminal for a mythological gemstone? When you put it that way, it does sound pretty stupid. Yeah, thanks for the input, Jeff. And it's supposedly in this temple. Uh, well, no. The stone itself isn't here. Hey, look at that. No? Uh, no, it's in Shambhala. Shambhala? Nate? Yeah, you know, Shangri-La. Can I have a word with you, darling? On second thought, perhaps we should continue this conversation inside. Good idea. Come on. All right, we should be saving here for now. This just doesn't add up, Nate. Lazarevich can't be after the money. He doesn't need it. You're missing something. Come on. We haven't got all day. You two stay here. Right. Promise me you'll stay put. We'll be right back. Famous last words. 
Oh, well, that's more like it. You don't think they're a couple, do you? They're not a couple. Ugh. Get a load of him. This is definitely the right temple. Well, that looks like the Chintamani stone, all right. There must be a hidden entrance here somewhere. Wait, I've seen this guy before. It's something to do with the arms. Wonder if there's any little keepsakes around here. Hang on, I'm gonna get a closer look at this thing. Sure. I'll just wait down here. I'm exhausted just looking at you. Nice one. Thank you. Oh! 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 God, you're lucky. Hey, come on, admit it. You're impressed. I am. I'll throw you a banana. What is it? Chloe, this isn't just a dagger. It's a key. Hmm. Well, let's find out what it opens. <sighs> Pretty creepy, but say ah. Uh... <clears throat> Do anything. The water's going down. And I found the door it opened. We've done it. Well, technically I did it. Be right there. 
What do you think? You game? Ladies first. If you say so. Uh, thank God I'm not claustrophobic. Huh. You know, it's actually kind of romantic down here. All right. There's the chocolates and flowers. <sighs> you never were a chocolate and flower kind of girl. Oh, you know me so well. You're not going to get us trapped in a small dark space 30 meters underground, are you? Uh, probably. <clears throat> a little bit of a drop. All right, I'm coming. Ugh. Little drop. Yeah, maybe I underestimated. What do you make of this? Looks like some kind of tree. Um, what's that got to do with the Tintamani thing? You got me. Hmm. Oh, it's opening up down here. Okay. Flashing before me. All right, come on, follow me. Oh, I'm hungry. Bloody hell. Oh, this must be the place. Thing looks familiar. Yeah, it looks like the Perba Dagger. Uh huh. These lights must activate it somehow. Those mirrors seem important. You just have to bounce the light around the room. One down, two to go. What do you reckon? We're gonna have to climb that thing? I reckon I'm gonna have to climb that thing. Let's get up here and see if we can get a better look. Okay, be careful up there. Whatever you do, don't fall. The 
This seemed like such a good idea down there. More reflectors up here. Chloe! Yeah? Adjust the other reflector. I'm on it. Nice work. Okay, now what? Hold on. Did it. Yep, that's another one down. It looks like that blade opened up a new path. To your left. Got it. One more blade to go. Now how am I going to get that eye open? We just need to adjust that other reflector. On my way. Good, that's it. I did it. down.
So, the secret of Shambhala is down this guy's throat? I guess so. That is. That's right here. You see the shape of, of that peak there? Uh huh. Here it is. Which means. Let me use your back. Which means. The entrance to Shambhala must be right here. So, we did it. We did it. Yes. <laughs> we did it. Oh crap. That kills the mood. There's only one way out of here. You ready? Let's go. They must have gone right through Jeff and Elena. We've got to get back to the entrance. I'm a little more worried about us right now. Chance. Let's get out of here. We gotta hurry.
Come on. Oh, shit. Where are they? I knew this would happen. Hey, over Lock here! There they are! Run. Stay down! Shit! Uh. Uh. There's a shot. Keep your heads down! We better keep moving. He's hit. Uh, I'm okay. Let me see. Oh. Alright, you're gonna be fine. Alright? Think you can stand? I think so. Alright, come on, I'll help you. No. No, 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 leave that. It's busted anyway. Here we go. Up. Oh. Nate. He's fine. Aren't you, Chief? All right, get the door open. He's never gonna make it. We have to leave him. What? No! Uh, get the door open, Chloe! He's gonna get us all killed! No, no, no. Let's Shit. go. Come on! No, Nate! I'll cover you! Hey, in here. Okay, we gotta get out of here. Let's go. Elena, barricade the door. You got it. Come on! Oh. Nate, we can't do this. Just go! Whoa! Stop that, you bastard! I think we're clear. Oh, look out! Pick up the pace. Come on, Jeff. You can make it. You're gonna be okay, Jeff. You're gonna be okay. No, stay with me. Holy shit! Effort, you think I'd known you longer, huh? <laughs> oh, shit! That's all right, we can make that. He can't. Oh, no, you don't. We don't have a choice. <laughs> Nate? Okay. You tried, but it's over. He can't go any further. We can't just leave him here to die. He is as good as dead already, and so are we if we don't go now. Then go. Yeah. Nobody's stopping you. Chloe. I was trying to save your skin, you idiot. Chloe? What is this? Sorry. Drop the guns. Seriously. Get her out of here. She's hurt. Take her to the train. Unbelievable. You just can't help yourself, can you? I guess that makes us even. Not quite.
you carry him all the way from the temple? Shame. No! Now, tell me what you found in the temple. The answer that you're looking for. Okay? I know where the stone is, but you're not gonna find it without me. So just... Just let her go, and I will lead you right to it. Ah, my shadow. You are the reporter who has been biting at my heels. You better pray that he is not bluffing. Search him. Come on. <laughs> that is brilliant, mate. Yeah. <laughs> it appears you have nothing to bargain with, Mr. Drake. Return to the staging ground. Prepare to move out. You, come with me. You. Take care of them. No problem. How can you work for that monster? Beats working against him, love. So that's it, huh? Just gonna mow us down in cold blood? Looks that way, doesn't it? Get up. I say get up! Ah! Run! No! Oh. Should have got you into this mess. You didn't. I got here on my own. Nah. I mean, you know, the, the rest of it. Oh, we knew what the stakes were. <sighs> okay, so, uh, what do we do now? I'm going after her. Huh. Of course you are. Typical. Go after her. <gasps> Flynn said something about a train. Which means they would have taken her to the rail yard. Here. So it should be that way. Past the water tower there. Nate, she pulled a gun on us. I know. She was about to pull the trigger, too. They just beat her to it. It's complicated. <laughs> yeah, I'll bet. Flynn knew she was with me. If Lazarevich finds out she double-crossed him, you know what he'll do to her. Yeah. I've seen his handiwork. Then you know I don't really have much of a choice. Honor among thieves, huh? Something like that. I sure hope you know what you're doing. I don't have the faintest idea. <laughs> ah, good to know that some things just never change. <laughs> okay, let's go. Oh, no, 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 no. You're not coming with me. Nate, shut up, okay? We have a train to catch. Where's the water tower? Right behind you. Spread out! Hit them off! Wait here. They're everywhere. Be careful. I always am. <laughs> Gun. 
Nothing yet. That's right. Shit, now we're cooking. All clear. All right, let's head to that water tower. We gotta find a way up there. Were you impressed? Got all those guys all by myself? Okay. Use the word impressed. Anything? There's a fire escape up here, but I can't reach it. All right, just wait up a sec. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Hey, once you're up there, just kick it down uh. to me. Huh? Yeah. There you go. Hey, look what I found. Matter. Is it locked? Uh, it's stuck. You know what? I think it's blocked from the other side. <laughs> All those years in the circus are paying off. Yeah, very funny. <laughs> Maybe from the circus, but you're the one behind bars. <laughs> Go. Try it now. Okay. Oh. Now I'm impressed. Oh no. Hey, we got company. Crap. They're up there on the left. The left. Ah. left and right, they're everywhere. That's all of them. Wait and use that. <clears throat> nice, we're at the water tower. Yeah, we made it. All right, stay low. Ugh. So you got a plan B? I'm working on it. There she is. 
Flynn's got her. Second thoughts? No. Okay. They're about to take this show on the road, so we're gonna have to move fast. Now I'm going down there alone. No, Nate. Wait, wait, wait. Just listen. You never listen. Meanwhile, you're gonna go over there. Snag is one of those nice looking four by fours. Four by fours. Mm -hmm. You're gonna be the wheel man. I'll sneak in, I'll grab Chloe. You come in right behind us. With the getaway car. With the getaway car. Yep, got it. Got it? I got it. Go. You all right? Whoa. Yeah. All right, be careful. All right. I'll see you when... I love the smell of train yards in the morning. Get up here for a better look. There's the train. How the hell am I gonna get down there? There's gotta be a way out of here. Get this old thing moving. all I need. Tweedledee and Tweedledee. Train's gone. Chloe's on it. The lady's nowhere to be found. Now these two mutants show up.
Chloe in the front car. Take your drink.
that noise. Oh, no way! <coughs> I gotta get off this thing. another way.
Again. Are you alright? Get off the train, mate. What are you talking about? You have any idea what I've been through? I never asked for any of your bloody heroics. Chloe, come on, we don't have time for this. You're right. So get off the train while you still can. And leave you with them. You made your choice. What did you expect me to do? I expected you to have my back. I had your back. How could you possibly with the other two on yours? Good luck with Flynn. We deserve each other. You know, I can't believe. You just don't know when to quit, do you? What? No witty remark? Nothing clever to say? I don't. No! <coughs> oh, no, you don't! Stop. Just let him go. Put him out of his misery!
They used to.
Or I'm going to climb out. Ah, oh. oh, shit, it's cold. Emma, call a sergeant tops and chit. Shepherds are like you, come on the top. How did I get here? Kabiche, Kira Gurumbulega di Chayo Mare. Kira Mashi was so de Chambore. How long have I been out? Yeah, Tom, Tom. Thanks. Uh, no, no, no. That's that's plenty. Uh, I'm sorry, I don't understand. Thanks. Yeah, uh, Yeah. Sure. Shepherd Karan Gudesha. Sure. Kukaranim de Kajeshi Gudesha. The hell am I? Sure. Yenam de Shaw. Guess I'm supposed to follow him. Does anyone speak English? I got it. Follow you. Go somewhere. Uh, boots. Excuse me. What? There you go. Get it. Do it, Jay. Kick it back. <laughs> One. Kick back. Kick it. Kick. Kick. Forget it. <laughs> <laughs> 
ちょっと見てみる。あんだ。いや、ちょっと見てみる。あんだ。いや、ちょっと見てみる。あんだ。いや、ちょっと見てみる。あんだ。いや、ちょっと見てみる。あんだ。いや、ちょっと見てみる。
Don't suppose you speak any English, do you, pal? <laughs> well, this looks inviting. What's it say? Do you touch anything? Why do I ask? Do you... Tesson? Yeah, I'm not so good with charades, pal. Opa! Show me a Wait! Tenzin! Why do you need that? Oh, man. There's no way we're getting across there. What you got there? What? Yeah, good luck, pal. I mean, that's almost impossible to... Oh, you did it. Nice. Sure, let's just swing across on the 70-year-old rope. Show, somebody! You need to show. I hope you know where you're going, buddy. Oh, didn't my daughter shot Kakodo? Exactly. That's what I was thinking. Oh, jeez. Looks like we're on the right track, but there's nothing here. This can't be what Schaefer meant. Oh, that way, sure. Those things bite, you know. What's the big hurry? Hello? These are snow boots, not track shoes. More wolves. Fantastic. Hey, show! What'd you find? What did Schaefer give me in my touch? It's been dead a long time. Yeah, Tada. Chintamani stone. Must have been one of Schaefer's men. Wait, what? what? Oh, my God. Uh, uh, uh. This not the best sauce. Come on. 
All right, I'll give you a boost. Mogo, ne kira ya ka? What? Ya ya, dayin da. Yeah, I still don't speak that. Me first, huh? Okay. Come on! I'll catch you! What's the I got you! Yeah, there you go. You owe me one, pal. Took it. Okay, we're even. Catch him, Maso. Not yet. What the hell was that? Yeah, come, Maso. What did this? Yeah, come on. Tenzin, we gotta get moving. Ah! 
What was that? All right, just stay here. Here. Such a delay, sir. Hey, Schaefer says hello. Well, let's hope this is loaded. Come here. I'll boost you up there. How am I going to get up there? Mika! Guys were dropping like flies.
that'll work. Stairs. Huh. Must be getting somewhere. Denson, stand on that other switch. Yeah, I'm to go. It's easy for you to say. I bet I could climb those. They were a little lower. Looks like there's a switch down there. <clears throat> Tenson! Pull that switch!
Sure, Tenzin. Take the easy way. Tenzin, take the easy way. Yaya! Great, now how am I gonna get across? somehow. Well, guess I'm doing it the hard way. Ah! 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 
Yes, and yeah. Yeah. So, good reflexes. Yeah, that takes. Oh. There's another way out of here. Drake, tell us shot. This must be them. Schaefer's expedition. Well. Chintamani stone. Look at this. These men were all shot. Oh, that's the uh, Irman Sul. It's uh, the life tree. Under Nerbe. Oh, Jesus. They were SS. Uh, Nazis. Nazi?
What would a man become? Tenzin. Schaefer did this. Ah. Schaefer killed them. Mare, mare. Yes. It's the only way to stop them. Oh. Oh, shit. We have to find a way out of here. Now. Yes. Hey, there's a switch. Tenzin! There's Sasu. Emma! Thank God! Oh, Nate. What happened? It's Lazarevich. They found us. Emma, go I don't know. I don't... I don't know. Schaefer's got her. Cut it. Mol Schaefer and Yam Dudo. Schaefer? They went the other way. All right. Nate, this is our fault. We did this. Just stay here. We keep them safe. Come on. Emily, Andy. Get back inside. Get inside. Who is those cops behind you? Get out here.
Go for show. Yeah. Emma. Emma. Ah, that's all. Go for it. Yeah. Emma. 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 Zhang Xian, I'll get you. What? I'll get you. Zhang Xian, I'll get you. Shiver, big guy. Holy shit! Oh crap! Jump! Jump! Why would he bring a tent?
RPG! RPG! Met for RPG. Double draw. Where the hell did he go? Is he drunk? Are you freaking kidding me? Where the hell did you go? I shoot shit. See about that.
Sergeant! Cover me! Schaefer. Where's Schaefer? We can't see you so. Nate! They took Schaefer. Oh, God. It's because he had the dagger. Yeah, I know. Hey! No time to argue. We gotta go. All right, oh, please scooch over. Okay. Garbage gets a hold of them. All right, I have an idea. Well, what are you doing? I'm gonna clear the road. Here, take the wheel. What? Just take it. Why didn't you just let me drive in the first place? I didn't think that far ahead. Yeah. All right, hold it steady. Okay. That's good.
just like old times, huh? <laughs> you could say that. So now what? They head to the creepy old monastery. What else? They're Schaefer. Damn it. What's happening? Lazarvish has him. Oh no. Ugh. You ready for this? As I'll ever be. Almost there. You got it? Uh-huh. Right, quietly now. Come on. Nice view. And then... No, no, I was talking about the mountains. Really. Come on. Who hasn't checked in? The last truck never arrived. An eye out. Right. Where is everyone? They went with Lazarevich. He took the old man into the monastery. He's alive! He's alive! Okay. It's up this way. Careful! Soldiers! They haven't seen us yet. Hang back, I'll take these guys out. Freezing up here! For the love of God! See about that.
This is Lucifer. Keep going. Ah. Go, go. Clear. It's gonna take both of us to get this door open. I'll hold it. You go first. Okay. <clears throat> That was close. It's a long way down. Looks like that beam's the only way across. I think I see a rope down there. Okay, sit tight. I'll go down there and throw it up to you. the rope. Catch! Got it! Right, follow me. have to jump for it. I'll catch you. Okay. I get you. There. See? No sweat. Come on, over here. Okay. Give me a hand. We'll push it. That's it. Whew. Hey, we can climb up this thing now. Come on. Be careful. God knows how old these boards are. Hey, I found a rope. There. Is that them? Yeah. They're moving Shaver into that tower. Ugh. Damn it. Come on, we've got to hurry. Locked. There's no way we're getting through here. Okay. I'll try to find another way around, open it from the other side. You sit tight. All right, just try to be subtle. We don't want to attract any unnecessary attention. Subtle. Right. Got it. Yeah. 
Eye out. Stay alert. I don't think so. I don't think so. Yeah, come on! Toast to the guy with the RPG.
We got snipers! Elena, come on! I'll boost you up. Watch yourself up there. Uh, all right, here. Uh, come on! He's here! Gotta get across that bridge. We can't go out there now. Those snipers will cut us to pieces. Hey, I think there's a sniper rifle up here. See ya, jackass. Oh! <gasps> 
Oh no! That taste. That's the last of them. Let's get across that bridge. There they are. Oh, that son of a bitch. We don't have much time. We gotta hurry. Come on! And there she goes. Right behind you. Are you okay? Run! Keep going! Oh boy. in a bridge with you again. Deal. All right, let's get these doors open. Okay. Come on, give me a hand. Uh. 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 Oh. Let's be careful. Right behind you. We're getting close. Get back. There's Lazarevich. Stand guard. Stay alert. Yes, sir. Where's Schaefer? I don't know. We must be holding him up there. There they are. You're dead, Drake.
get it. Okay. Go. Uh oh. Just like the fire escape. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, when you get up there, kick it down. Oh. oh, no. I didn't mean literally. Oh, hang on, hang on. Back away, back away. Special delivery. <laughs> Good thinking. Go. Uh, oh. Ow. Uh, you hanging in there? Yeah, cute. Uh, uh, uh. All right. There you go. Closer. Okay. Hey, hey, hey. Shh. Keep your eyes open. All right. Keep your head down. Stay alert. No. <sighs> Come on, follow me. Oh. Up there. That must be where they're holding Schaefer. What? Ah, oh, crap. Get down. No. It's okay. We're here. You are right. About what? Everything you touch does turn to shit. All right, come on. We're gonna get you out of here. No. What do we do? Did you find my expedition? Yes, I found them. You understand what I had to do? Yes. If they had found the stone, it would have changed the course of history. <coughs> easy, easy. 
He took the dagger. I know. He's gone to the tower. You have to stop him. <clears throat> try, try not to move. Uh, this monastery hides the secret path to Shambhala. You must get the dagger back, find the secret path, and destroy the stone before he gets his hands on it. Drake, you have to believe. Oh. Schaefer. Oh, Nate. We can't just leave him. What choice do we have? You heard him. Do you think all this really could be true? I don't know. But he believed it. That's enough for me. <sighs> okay. I think we should split up. What? No, listen. I'll go scope out the secret entrance thing, and you go to the tower and figure out how to get that dagger back. Uh, yeah, all right. Uh, just keep your head down and uh, stay in radio contact. Yeah, okay. Good luck. the tower. Shoot again.
There's another one of them. Nate, there's something strange going on over here. There's some sort of 
animals. Yeah. I probably should have warned you about them. Warned me? Wait, you knew about these things? When were you planning on telling me? Just lay low and stay out of their way. Finally, tower. I'm tired of your excuses. Look, give me some more time. That's all I'm asking. <laughs> I have given you enough time. I have brought you the dagger. Now, where is the gate to Shambhala? Look, Zoran, we know... <laughs> I have not come this far to be thwarted by your incompetence. We know the answer is somewhere in this room. We just have to find it. Meanwhile, Drake remains just one step behind you. <laughs> I clearly hired the wrong man for the job. What an asshole. I'll, uh, I'll try to smooth things over with him. Just stay here. See what you can work out. That belongs to me. Nate? Get out of here. Give me the dagger. They'll be here any Chloe, minute. Chloe, don't make me take it from you. How am I supposed to explain where it's gone? Well, you'll think of something. You always do. Just... Just do one thing for me. Take that son of a bitch down. For. Wait a minute, this all looks familiar. I bet I could move these things. Ah, this one's in the wrong spot. Damn it. Ugh. <sighs> 
Huh. Alright. What's next? Sully when you need him. Should do it. Oh, shit. More? Okay, I've seen these symbols before. Sided, just like the dagger. Well, 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 what have we here? Elena, can you hear me? Yeah. I think I just found the secret entrance. Really? Yeah. Y you see the base of the cliff with all the statues? Uh-huh. Meet me there. You got it. I'm on my way. Here, I can see you. What the hell are those guys doing? Looks like they're pulling the statues down to find that secret entrance. The geniuses are right on top of it. Well, here goes nothing. Okay, I'm ready when you are.
entrance. It's right here. This is it. <laughs> I knew it. Here, help me push. Okay. Put your back into it. Nag, nag, nag. I think there might be a quick way down over here. Uh, uh. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> At least it's keeping them busy. Uh. You see that? Stay back. On the rope, boys. Hope there's nothing scary at the top. All right, it's all clear. Come on. Getting close, I know it. There's some doors up here. I need your help. Okay. Alright. Go. Here it is, Elena. The secret entrance to Shambhala. Nate? Yeah. Don't see it. Neither do I. If I have to climb another wall... Keep looking around. There has to be a clue somewhere. Are you sure this is it? It has to be. 
We're missing something. That's it. What? Watch. Stay behind me. Drop the gun. Do it! Stay back! Shit. I should have killed you myself when I had the chance. Not a mistake I will make twice. Back off! Oh, pull the trigger, little one. See how long you live. Now, you will open the passage to Shambhala. Go to hell. Are you a student of history, Mr. Drake? I've read a book or two. Mm. Genghis Khan, Hitler, Stalin, Pol Pot, they were all great men. But do you know why they prevailed? I'm sure you're gonna tell us. Because they had the will to do what other men would not. <laughs> Compassion is the enemy. Mercy defeats us. Now, unless you wish to test me still further, you will drop your weapons! Do it. Kick them away. So, you have tested my will. Now it is my turn to test yours. Killing us won't get you anywhere. Or killing him, yes. But you? You hurt her. You get nothing from me. Well, then it appears we are at a stalemate. Unless I add another pawn to the board. Bring her in! Shit. Oh. Get your hands off me. <laughs> now, one we will use as a lesson, and the other we will use as incentive to cooperate. You choose. This is bullshit, Nate. Yeah, don't play into his game. You want my help, you let them go. This is not a negotiation! Who would you sacrifice, and who would you save? What, this one? You want to save this one? Or maybe this one? Hmm? You know what? Enough of this shit. All right, quit the theatrics. I'll do what you want. Calm down. You, asswipe. Give me your lighter. Should I know? Find a way across. And fix it! And take him with you. Maybe this time it will get done right. Oh, I missed the Drake. Don't try anything clever. After you? Stabbing son of a bitch. Yeah, well, I learned from the best, didn't I? Uh, 
Come on. You first, darling. Yeah, ah. Big man with that gun, aren't you? Don't go far. Try to keep up. I'm keeping up. I'm letting you go first. Hold on. Wait for me. Daddy's got a gun. I can't believe Help. Lazarevich hasn't killed you yet. Yeah. Give me a boost, buddy. <laughs> buddy. There we go. Oh, look out. It's a stone throw. Yeah. Hey! Sorry. Is that blocking your path? Glad you find this so funny. Huh. No, wait for me! <sighs> Sorry about that. Great. What's wrong, mate? Don't you trust me? <laughs> oh! See? You should have more faith in me, chub. There you go, sweetheart. Get ahead of me. Go on. You better not be leading me into a dead end. It's through here. I don't think you're gonna get your stomach through there. Help me move this. Aye, aye. Okay, teamwork. Just like the good old days, eh? Now, how did they get that cart there? Who cares? We just have to get up high. It's like Stonehenge, isn't it? <clears throat> no. Help me push this. Come on, girly girl. There you go. Statue of your mom. Oh, look, it's a life size statue of your ego. Hope you can make that jump on your own. I sure as hell am not going to help you. You can do it! I can't! Little help! Little help! Never mind, just kidding. <sighs> Alright, let's open it up. As they say, behind the door, here's another door. Okay. So what do you have to do? What do we have to do? Just wait here. As usual, I'll take care of everything. Would you? Wait. What? Those symbols. I know those symbols. <laughs> Such a little book. Such big cylinders. As the world turns, so does my boredom. Could you hurry up? Oh, I'm trying to concentrate.
Come on, mate. We haven't got all day. Wouldn't want to piss off Lazarevich, now would we? Do me a favor, Flynn. Shoot my ears off, please. That just came out the floor. Come on, make yourself useful. What are we grinding wheat? What is this? There we go. Smells like water. Guardians to frighten trespassers. Yeah? Well, it's bloody effective. Zarvich, done what you asked. Let them go. Always bargaining. But you have played your last hand and lost. Looks like it's the end of the road, mate. No, 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 no. Not yet. I want him to see Shambhala and die knowing that I have taken it from him. Open the gate! been a thorn in my side for far too long. On your knees. Well, hey, hey, uh, Zorin, we had a deal. I do not suffer traitors. Oh, right, so I suppose you know exactly how to find stone then, won't be needing me. <laughs> Thanks. On your knees! What is this? Fire, you fool! Look out! 
keep going! Look out! Shoot something! to get the hell out of here, now. I couldn't sleep for days after I saw that last time. All right, let's go. Come on, no time to sightsee. Let's keep moving. Someone else made it in here before us. Let's hope we have better luck making it out. Yeah. These bodies look like they've been here 60, 70 years. Hey. Didn't seem to do them much good, but here. Thanks. Mm-hmm. Well, Lazarovich and his crew will have headed into the city, so if we can just make it back to the entrance, it should be clear by now. Uh, no, Chloe, we're going after the Chintamani stone. <laughs> what? We have to stop Lazarovich. And how exactly do you plan on doing that? Get to the stone first before he does and destroy it. Whoa, whoa, wait a minute. Don't tell me you're buying into all that supernatural nonsense. I, I don't know what to believe anymore. Okay, well, just in case you missed it, that man is certifiable. He thinks he's fulfilling some sort of prophecy that the stone will somehow make him invincible. Immortal. <laughs> We're standing in the middle of Shambhala, and you're questioning what's possible? Yeah, you saw how many bullets they pumped into those things? Something strange is going on here. All the more reason why we should get out while we still can. Uh, I'm just trying to set things right. And maybe save the world? Oh, God. <laughs> Listen, Sunshine. The world <laughs> doesn't care. You stick your neck out, you are asking to lose your head. You said yourself you want to take this guy down. Yes, and I want to see him pay more than you do. But that's not how it will end. This, this is how it will end. No, not this time. <sighs> Come on. What do you say? That you're crazy. But let's go save your bloody world. That's for sure. You can make these jumps. Hey, that's sap. It's just like the resin. That stuff is flammable. Stand back. 
What the hell? Oh my god, what is that? The sap is flammable, just like the resin we found. Oh, great. Little warning next time, maybe. <laughs> Now we're talking. Let's go. Wait, that looks familiar. Of course. That must be where the Chintamani stone is. It's all so beautiful. This place really must have been something back in the day. Kind of quiet. It does feel kind of haunted, doesn't it? Got company. Again? Shh. Told you. Too damn quiet. Maybe they haven't seen us yet. Helena, get back. Oh, these soldiers are crawling all over the place. Counterweight's missing. Well, you look about the right size. <laughs> <laughs> Funny. I'm on it. Okay, here we go. Uh, uh, uh. Go! 
were cutting that a little fine. You guys all right? We need to get up to that ledge. Let's use the cart. That'll do it. Nice work, guys. Thanks for the help, Chloe. Don't mention it. There it is. Oh shit! Get down! There's guardians down here too! Oh! 
the guys with the slings! They just keep coming! Stone's got to be here somewhere. Let's try heading up. All right. Come on. We better hurry. Almost there. There it is. The Chintamani stone. I can't believe we beat them here. It's beautiful. Yep. Magnificent. <clears throat> now let's smash it and get the hell out of here. Uh, wait. Something's not right. What do you mean? Marco Polo had it wrong. This isn't a sapphire, it's amber. Amber? Yeah, you know, fossilized resin. It's tree sap. Wait a minute. What is it? You gotta be shitting me. Hello, Nate. I hate it when he does this. Tell me about it. How could I have missed it? Missed what? There's not actually a stone. It's the resin, the sap from the Tree of Life. Okay, hold on. Now you've lost me. This tree. No. That tree. There he is. Lazarevich. He's headed to the tree. Oh my god. The black teeth. What? The black teeth on those guardian things and the bodies in Borneo. They ate the resin, and it changed them somehow. And you think that's what Lazarevich is planning to do? You really want to wait around and find out? Bravo, shut up. Well done. Flynn? Jesus. Oh, Harry. What's the matter, mate? Disappointed Lazarevich beat you to it? I'm afraid you just missed him. Figured I'd stay behind and wait for you to come join my little party. What are you talking about? <laughs> Maybe that's what old Zoran wanted all along, eh? He's cleverer than he looks. Well, we can still stop him. <laughs> Elena, don't. No, we can help you. Sorry, love. This isn't a movie. And you're not the plucky girl who reforms the villain and saves the day. It's just not done like that. Flynn, listen to me. Parting gift from Lazarevich. Pity he took the pin. Get back! Elena! <laughs> no. Oh my god. Elena! Okay. You're gonna be okay. Come on, we're gonna get you out of here. Come on. Just stop, Lazarevich. Go! Not a chance. Come on. <laughs> It's all right, I've got her. You cover us. Right, this way. Lazarevich. Screw Lazarevich. We have to get Elena out of here. I'll clear the way. Uh. Come on, honey. Come on. Stay right here. Okay. 
Okay, we're gonna move. Come on. You can do it. We got Watch company. Out. Okay, a little bit further. Here we go. Okay, hang back. <laughs> That's the last of them. Hey. Hey, Elena, how you doing, huh? Not good. You just hang in there, okay? I'm counting on you. Head for the gate. Go as fast as you can. What, what, what do you mean? No. No way. Look, Chloe, I have to end this. No, you don't. Don't you dare take on this stupid crusade. <clears throat> Just get her out of here. Not without you. Look, if that stuff could really transform Lazarevich and his army... Please don't do this. If it could actually make him invincible, and I didn't try to stop it. But this is suicide. And you know it. Just go. Get as far away from this place as you can. You're not my type. <laughs> no. No, no, no. You have got to be kidding me. Yeah. <laughs> 
am a monster. But you're no different from me, Blake. How many men have you killed? How many just today? That's it, boy. No compassion. No mercy. Do it! No. <laughs> you don't have the will. Maybe not. But they do. Just hold on. Come on, stay with us. You're gonna be okay, right? You're gonna be fine. You're gonna be just fine. Elena, don't do this. Elena! So, it's been a long, strange trip, hasn't it? Yes, it has. <laughs> you know, you should play the hero more often. It suits you. Nah. <laughs> Tell me something, Nate. What? Do you love her? Chloe, I'm sorry. No, it's fine. Really, it's all right. Just do yourself a favor, cowboy. Tell her. Chloe. No. My 
my turn to walk away. But admit it. You're gonna miss this ass. <laughs> well, look who's not supposed to be out of bed. Yeah, he's a lousy patient. Stubborn as all hell. I'm not stubborn, I'm just restless. <laughs> so, no giant sapphire. Once again, no. <laughs> and you're sure of that? Yes. <laughs> just a metaphor, I'm afraid. Metaphor ain't gonna pay your bills, kid. Well, something else will come along. Just gotta have faith. Yeah. That and a quarter will get you 25 cents. <laughs> uh, which way'd Chloe go? See you later. Oh, no. <laughs> You're a dirty old man, Sullivan. Uh-huh. <sighs> you did good, Nate. I think he'd approve. Yeah? Uh-huh. All men dream, but not equally. Those who dream by night, in the dusty recesses of their minds, Wake in the day to find that it was vanity. But the dreamers of the day are dangerous men. For they may act their dream with open eyes to make it possible. This I did. Up. Enjoying yourself, pal? Oh, yeah, you're a comedian. Nice warm welcome. They're both clean. My apologies. One can't be too careful. I'm guessing you're Talbot? Mr. Sullivan. And Mr. Drake. That's right. Do you have it? Let's, uh... See the money first. Cut out. It's all there. Now let's see it. I'll need to authenticate it. Of course. Silver. 16th century, Elizabethan design, inscribed with Sir Francis Drake's motto. Well, it appears to be genuine. Well, of course it's genuine. If I may ask, how did you two come into this? Does it matter? <laughs> My client will be very pleased. Hold on a minute. Sully, this is fake. I assure you, Mr. Drake. Oh, oh, you are right. This is phony as a $3 bill. What the hell are you trying to pull here? Perhaps I should be asking you. This is bullshit. Deal's off, pal. And you? You can tell your client. You blew it. Come on, Nate, let's get the hell out of here. You're not really in a position to negotiate. Now give me the ring, take the case, and walk out of here like gentlemen. While you still can. Do as the man says, son. <laughs> Here's the 
you're a thief. Well now, that's ironic. Come on, you best you got. This one's mine. Yeah, you and me. Me. Come on! Yeah, I am. Right. No time to rest. Yeah. All right, mate. You're done for. There, big fella. I got him. Uh, quick, hit him. Not bad idea, Granddad. Uh, uh, damn it! Uh. Second there, mate. I'll be right with you. my pride. Come on. Let's go, Nate. Here. We can get out the back. Stop him! I've got the old geezer! How's that? Ready to go, kid? Yeah. Let's go. You might. Don't. Stay down.
Hello, Victor. Kate? Still wallowing in the gutter with your protege, I see. Not very dignified for a man of your age. Should have known you'd be behind this. Oh, careful now. Wouldn't want you to melt. <laughs> Same cocky little shit. So fearless. I wonder what you're really afraid of. Not bullets or blood or broken bones. No. You get off on all this, don't you? Cheating death. Or not. No. <sighs> Mr. Sullivan, I won't harm your precious boy. I merely want what's mine. Give me that back. Oh, oh no. Oh. Shut, Shut up. up. You fool. Oh, you're bloody welcome, Your Majesty. Marlow, we have to get you out of here. Ah, oh, come on. They're a right pair of arseholes. What? Maybe upstairs. <sighs> it's gotta be in one of these cases. El museo cierra en 15 minutos. Wait, here it is. Ratita callejera, suélteme. Clase de gente no es bienvenida aquí. Y quédate afuera. Pendejo. Oh, there he is. Vida de 
aquí. Keep up with him. Ah, there he is. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> it was rotten anyway. Ah, now where did he go? Where is he going? Now what's he doing? He's going upstairs. Oh, damn. It's locked. Hmm. Gonna have to find another way up. What's he doing in there? I need to get a better look. I don't want to rush your pal, but can yeah. you move it along? Just so that I got a lady with you. know that is. Aquí lo tiene. That's a ticket. Gracias. Adiós, amigo. Okay. I gotta get that wallet. Crap. I can't go down that way. to that building. I bet I can spot him from the roof. Oh, who's your friend? Don't want to 
lose him. Let's try that again. Let go of me. Ah, that's what I thought. Now don't try to run. You're a long way from home, son. Don't call me that. Parents must be worried about you. <laughs> yeah, not likely. Okay, sore subject. That was a nice lift back there. You're pretty good. I don't know what you're talking about, old man. Hey, don't call me that. Your technique is really sloppy, though. You telegraph in all your moves. You're crazy. Yeah? You've been tailing me all over town. Probably figured me for an easy mark. But you picked the wrong guy, pal. Uh, uh. What? My wallet. Fine. Maybe we'll just call the police. Go ahead. Of course, they might wonder why a middle-aged tourist is following young boys down alleyways. <laughs> you are a crafty little beggar, aren't you? I know how to take care of myself. Anyway, I'm pretty sure you don't like the cops any more than I do. Good point. Kid. The wallet. Had to try. Of course you did. Telegraphing all my moves, huh? Museum's closed. Look who it is. The filthy little stray that made off with your wallet. Come on, son. You haven't got a chance. Just hand it over. Now, the ring.
What ring? <laughs> Catherine! Who do you think you are, boy? You're nothing but a filthy, cast-off little beggar. You're not fit to touch these objects. What the hell do you think you're doing? He's just a kid. Stop him! <laughs> <laughs> Stop the boy! Holy crap! He has the ring! Break the door down! Uh. Oh god! He's heading for the roof! Catch him! Change! Uh. Uh. Break it! Hurry! Let's go! Uh. Oh, crap. Who the hell are these guys? Come here, you little bastard! Got you, you little shit! Come here, you little bastard! Never shooting at me? Okay, kid. You can relax, kid. We're safe here. Go on. Suit yourself. You don't want it. What do you want from me? Hmm. A little gratitude would be nice. 
I did just save your ass back there. Thanks. But what's in it for you? I mean, you're a crook, right? <laughs> you gotta have an angle. <laughs> you are one piece of work, kid. What's your story, anyway? Look, mister. No offense, but I don't even know you. Easily remedied. Victor Sullivan. This should be the part where you introduce yourself. Okay. Suppose you tell me what's so special about that ring. It belongs in my family. I'm just taking it back. Passed down from Francis Drake himself. That's right. I don't know how to break this to you, kid, but Drake didn't have any heirs. No children. Well, not with his wife back in England, anyway. <laughs> okay, good point. Let me see it. Come on, kid. If I was gonna take it from you, I would have done it by now. Thank you. So, what is this? Parvis? Mem Sick Parvis Magna. It means greatness from small beginnings. That was his motto. Yeah? You see, Queen Elizabeth gave it to him in 1581, when he got back to England after circumnavigating the globe. That's when she made him a knight. Well, you sure as hell didn't learn that on the streets. How's a kid your age know Latin? The nuns sort of insisted on it. Ah, uh, so like a boarding school. That's a nice word for it. Okay, then. So what was all that business with the ring and that astrolabe thing back there? Why don't you tell me? You're the one working for them. Look, kid. A client wants something, I obtain it. For a price. I don't ask any questions. It's just a job. Look pretty friendly to me. Yeah, uh, well, anyway, I'm pretty sure I'm fired. Okay, look. First of all, that was no astrolabe. It's some sort of decoding device. Check this out. On his way around the world, Drake sailed through the East Indies. Only he says that it took him six months to get from here to here. Yeah, so? So it doesn't add up. He was way too good a sailor for that. It would have taken him a month. Tops. He was hiding something. Something big. How big? Like secret mission from the Queen big. Like millions in plundered treasure that hasn't ever been recovered big. That big? That big. And that... Decoder has something to do with it. I would bet my life on it. Oh, swell. And Marlowe's got it. Won't do her much good without the key. So it's a stalemate, then? For now. <laughs> so you still haven't told me what your name is? And you still haven't told me what you want from me. Okay. Look, you got talent, but you got a lot to learn. You stick with me, and I'll teach you a few things. Thanks. But I'm doing just fine on my own. Yeah, clearly. What do you say we uh, try this again? My friends call me Sully. Nathan Drake. Nate. Drake, huh? <laughs> OK. I see great things in our future, kid. Great things. <laughs> no. And... They're gone. All right, lads? <laughs> oh, God. Bet you were gonna put a silencer on that thing. Sally, you've got no sense of drama. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. All right. All that racket's gonna bring the cops any minute. Let's get the hell out of here. <sighs>
Could have pulled a couple of those punches, Charlie. What do you mean? I hardly touched you. You headbutted me. All right, all right. I got a little swept up in the moment. Uh, you were the one who said make it look realistic. Better stay on his good side. <laughs> all right, Broad Ice. Look sharp. They're coming your way. Don't lose them. <sighs> Told you they'd take the bait. How long do you reckon before they realize this is a fake? Who cares? Finally flushed them out. And now we just follow them back to their hole. You do realize you make everything sound dirty. I do? Let's get moving. Well, hurry it up, Nate. Shit. The filth. This way. What? Come on. Really? Come on, Charlie. What's the holdup? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, all right. It'll all be over soon. It'll all be over soon. It'll all be over soon. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Oh, that wasn't too bad. What the hell is wrong with you? Nothing, I'm fine. <clears throat> That's blocked. Wait, we can get around this way. Yeah, yeah, right. Or we could just use a little muscle. <clears throat> oh, there's a thought. The wall's too high. Here, let's move this thing over there. I got it. Put your back into it, mate. We haven't got all bloody night. Yeah. Thanks for the help. Come on, move your lazy asses. All right. Looks like the coast is clear. You should be more careful with your head, you know. <laughs> Good evening, lads. All right, darling. <sighs> Looks like hell spit you two back out. Uh, it was a thing of beauty, Chloe. I went off without a hitch. You're unusually quiet. What's up your bum? Oh, well, Charlie seemed to enjoy himself a little bit too much for there my taste. Go. <laughs> my ears are still ringing. Oh, for God's sake. Helps if you have something in between. <laughs> oh, it looks like I missed out on some fun. Yeah, you did, actually. It was very, very uh, cathartic. Yeah, it's funny. Do you have any trouble? Nah, <sighs> easy peasy. And you're sure they didn't see you trailing them? Not a chance. So, which door scary pop inside him behind? Behind that one there. The green one. They drove in ages ago, and it's been dark ever since. You think they're still in there? Well, I haven't taken my eyes off it. And no one's gone in or out. Hmm. Think these are really necessary? I mean, it's not like they're expecting us. Don't underestimate these blokes. They're not messing about. Hey, we're just gonna sneak in, and we sneak out. Just like that. Yeah, fair enough. But any trouble, you shoot first and ask questions later, all right? Man, I was sorely tempted to just pick up that briefcase back there and walk. Yeah, you got a lousy poker face, mate. Hey, trust me, that's nothing compared to what we're onto. Yeah, well, at my age, a bird in the hand, you know. Ew, didn't I tell you? Oh, please. Look, I just hope you're right about this. Seems pretty quiet. You think they're still in there? Well, we're not gonna just barge in the front door and find out. Well, we can't afford to waste time standing here. I'll find a way in, check it out. You three stay here. Got it. Empty? 
Wait a minute, where did it go? Where the hell did they go? This doesn't make any sense. Give me a hand with this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got it. Does anybody see a car? Because I don't see a car. I don't understand. <laughs> Damn it. I'm sure this is the right one. Yes, the green door, I'm sure. Nate, we are losing time here. And that damn briefcase is looking better and better. All right, come on. They didn't just vanish into thin air, right? There's got to be an explanation. Just spread out and look around. They were here, all right. I can still smell the exhaust. Tire tracks. Still wet from the rain. Looks like the car turned here. Hey, check this out. Come on, you're supposed to be the smart one. What are we missing? Oh, some kind of mechanism. Yeah, maybe. Four tires, four points of contact. Sully, stand right there. You two, right there and there. All right, everybody, on three. Ready? One, two, three. And? Well, this has got to be it. Wait. Wait, it's the light. Sully, aim your beam at the wall. Like headlights. <laughs> Goddamn cadaver. Um, Nate, just who are we dealing with here? Well, there's only one way to find out. We'll track the car. You head back to the van. We'll try and stay in radio contact. I'll let you know when we get through to the other side, all right? <laughs> Wherever the hell that is. Just be ready for anything. Might be a quick exit. No doubt. She's the best driver in the business, you know. So I've heard. Well, I think we agree this is more than a little weird. Who the hell drives their car underground? Oh, well, let me think. Someone who doesn't want to be followed, you know, it's just a guess. Smart ass. It looks like they bored straight into the old service tunnels. Hey, over here. It's locked. Not for long. Should be able to squeeze through here. Thank you. Lead on, Macduff. What? Lay on. It's lay on, Macduff. <sighs> Can we hurry it along, please, mate? All right, back there. Yeah, yeah. You know, just just not keen on the old tight spaces. That's all. Uh, just keep moving. Who the hell is Macduff? Is there no bottom to your ignorance? What was that? I see them! Oh, oh yeah, nice one, mate. Thanks. Tunnel's right below us. At least we're still on the right path.
Oh, that is a long way down. Careful, it's slippery. There's more. Get down. Take cover. What's that? Well, that could have gone better. Hey, there's a passage up there. And a ladder. Yeah. Looks like it's jammed, though. Let me see if I can loosen it. Look out. Here it comes. Hold on, mate. Looks like there's some sort of gate up there. You cut her a little help here. Sure, I gotcha. All right, ready? Pull. Got it. Okay, Charlie, come on. the tunnel again. That's too far to drop though. We'll break our damn necks. Crap. It's a dead end. Down here. Where the hell are we headed now? What in the world? Charlie, who the hell are we dealing with here? I don't know, mate. Whoever they are, they are seriously weird. Look at the ironwork. Oh, it's got to be Victorian, maybe older. Yeah. All this stuff's been rusting for a century. Maybe we can get through here. Looks like it's stuck. Right, one of us should climb up there and see if they can dislodge it. Good idea. Guess who? <laughs> ah, crap. Was there? Go. 
Good eye. Hey, there's more of his car. Back. All right. From here on, no more guns. Hands up. Oh, I don't know. We must have taken a wrong turn somewhere. Yeah, is this King's Cross? Don't move. Hey, hey, you got us all wrong, man. We're from Cleveland. Oh, well done, mate. That a boy. What the hell kind of place is this? I've never seen anything like it. Some sort of train station or something. Yeah, yeah, but it's got to be almost 200 years old. Jesus, just when you think things can't get any weirder. Shh, get back. Take them out quietly. Nicely done, boys. Come on. They must have gone through here. It gets weirder. Oh, this stonework. Looks like Tudor. 16th century. Up this way. Quietly, Nate. Hey, over here. I'm not interested in your excuses. He was a loose cannon, and you should have known. Yes, it is regrettable, but... Not regrettable. Sloppy. Your poor judgment could have cost us everything. Four hundred years of searching. Finally, Drake's secret will be revealed. What is this? I don't understand. It's a forgery. What? That's not possible. I verified it myself. This isn't the ring. Really? I held it in my hands. I saw him put it around his neck. This doesn't make sense. We've been duped. Cutter. Uh-huh. You men stand guard and stay alert. We may have been followed. You, come with us. Find them and bring me that ring. I don't care how you get it. Quite the operation they got going here. Look at all this stuff. Ugh. Nate, focus. We haven't got much time here. Yeah. What are you... My God, do you know what this is? It's a book, mate. There's a lot of them in here. It's a library. It's not just any book, wise ass. Belonged to T.E. Lawrence. You know, Lawrence of Arabia. Yes, 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 I know who he is. 
This was mailed from Dorset on the day of his motorcycle accident. May 13th, 1935. They must have killed him once they got their hands on it. They? Yeah, they, they, them, whoever these people are. Oh, what a lot of rubbish. It was an accident. Witnesses saw a black car run him off the road. Guys. Oh, oh Walter, it was like a big cover-up. Maybe. Nate. What? That thing that you have been waiting 20 years for? Right. Here we go. L O H D N. Huh. What is it? Uh, it's long hidden. What? Shush. No shit, long hidden. Are you kidding me? No offense, mate, but your ancestor was a right asshole. Just shut up. It's an anagram. Golden Hind. The Golden Hind. Drake ship. Yes. It's a clue. It's gotta be something hidden in this room. All right, spread out. See what you can find. What the hell are we looking for, anyway? The Golden Hind. Could it be a model? Maybe a painting. Well, what makes you think it's even here? It's gotta be here. Well, it could be a Buckland Abbey for all we know. What? Buckland of course. Abbey. It's a place you've there it is. There. Move on. I found it. Where? Up there. The figurehead from Drake's ship. It's a trap! They're here! Take cover! That's right! We went to Arabia! <laughs> hey, we can use an LL here! Come on, Nate! Let's go! What the hell are you doing? Grab the journal and the cipher disk! Got it! Go! Go! We're running out of ammo! Grab their weapons!
Hey, there's a ladder. Come on, hurry up! Where the hell are we? It's the North Atwood Station. Come on! Can you read me? We're coming out the old North Outward Station. There's no time to explain. says, well, you better tickle mine, too, because now i got to catch the goddamn thing. <laughs> Cheers. Mm. To a job? Well done. Yeah. Are you going to join us, darling? Yeah. Yeah. Well, the map proves it. Drake didn't screw around in the East Indies for six months. He sailed straight through and headed to Arabia. Right. But here's where it gets interesting. You see this, Mark? This is John D.'s signature. Who the hell's John D? John D? One of Queen Elizabeth's closest advisors. Everybody knows that. Yeah, yeah. He was a great mathematician and navigator. Okay, way ahead of his time. He's probably the one who invented that. Seriously into the occult. I mean, like a really creepy dog. Yeah, see, way. he signed all his letters to the Queen with this symbol, meaning he was her eyes. The original 007, you see? Look, 007. Not really that relevant. So it was John D who sent Drake to Arabia? Yeah, it looks that way. D and Elizabeth. And Walsingham. Great, but what for? Well, that's the million-dollar question, isn't it? And this is where T.E. Lawrence comes in. See, before Lawrence became Lawrence of Arabia... Great film. He was an archaeologist. And even when he was just a kid, he was obsessed with history. Everything to do with knights and the Crusades. And he traveled all over, documenting every Crusader site he could find. It, it's all in here. All right, you lost me completely, kid. What the hell has this got to do with Drake? I'm getting to that. See, after the war, Lawrence said that if he were ever to go back to Arabia, it would be to search for this place he called the Atlantis of the Sands. Now, the legend crops up over and over again under different names. Ubar, Aram of the Pillars, the City of Brass. But the story is always the same. Well, city of immeasurable wealth, destroyed by God for its arrogance, swallowed forever in the sands of the Rubel-Kali Desert. Right here. Well... <laughs> I like the immeasurable wealth part, anyway. And you think this is what Elizabeth and Dee sent Drake after? Oh, yeah. And more importantly, it's what Marlowe is after. So, wait. If Drake was on a mission from the Queen to find this place, why all the secrecy? I mean, it looks like he went to a lot of trouble to hide whatever he found. 
Even from Her Majesty. I don't know. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, what was that? No, hang on a second, because if you recall the last time we went halfway around the world searching for a lost city, things got more than a little dicey. Yeah, but this time we have the upper hand. I mean, look, Drake only had half the clues, Lawrence only had half. We have both, and Marlowe has nothing. Small problem. The Rubalcali Desert, 600 miles across. The Bedouin go around the damn thing. And even if we knew where it was, which we don't, we would die trying to find Just it. Just hold on. You see these symbols here? Yeah. Looks like Sabian script. Sabian script. Right. Look, the Crusaders were searching for the same lost city a thousand years ago. But out of all the sites Lawrence documented, only two are marked with these symbols. One in Syria, the other in France. No, you two are going to Syria. We're heading to France. Look, we track down these clues. We find Lawrence's lost city. I'm sure of it. Well, and then what? How are we going to get across 600 miles of impossible wasteland? Well, it's in the middle of the desert. So technically, it'd be about 300 miles. Oh. <laughs> Look, I don't know. We'll figure it out. We burn that bridge when we get to it, eh? Exactly. What do you say? What the hell? Let's do it. <laughs> Into the line, I guess. Don't. <laughs> Looks like we're going the rest of the way on foot. What? Leave it to you to find a friggin' jungle in the middle of France. <laughs> well, we're definitely headed in the right direction. Chateau should be this way. Not too far. Come on. Yeah. Not too far? <laughs> With you, I never know if that means a quarter mile or twenty. Like that time you got us lost in Peru? Oh, you really want to bring up Peru? You are not still holding that over me. I was 15, Sully. Should have known when I met you that I'd be in prison within a year. <laughs> you were headed that way all on your own, if you recall. <laughs> Besides, I got you out, didn't I? I always get you out. Come on, through here. There it is, just like in Lawrence's notes. Gotta have more faith in me, Sully. Of course, I don't remember this ravine being on the map. Ah, they must have just put that in. All right. Come on, we'll find another way around. Hey, is that a pan flute? This way. Watch your step. Who? I don't know, kid. You sure we're in the right place? This doesn't seem old enough to be a crusader castle. Looks more like renaissance to me. You haven't been reading my books again, have you, Sully? <laughs> now, Lawrence says the original castle was built in the 11th century. The rest was added on later. Oh, this looks sketchy. Ooh. Look, Sully, your first car. Oh, man. That's a 1927 Auburn. Uh. Yeah? What's this, Mr. Wizard? Lawn art. Pretty tacky. 
Now, the knight who owned this castle, Lord Godfrey, returned from the Crusades in the 12th century. According to Lawrence, all that's left of the original castle is the square keep and the gardens. If Godfrey brought any secrets back from Arabia, that's where we're gonna find him. I'll try this door. Not getting in this way. that window above you. I don't want to cut myself. All right, nice going, kid. Be right back. All right, back up. I'll shoot the lock off. Make sure that's the only thing you shoot off. I said lock. You good? Okay. Gotta make our way through the chateau to the gardens. That's where we'll find the old keep. Oh, man. Look at this place. Get it open. This damn beam's in the way. Yeah, we gotta get some leverage. Think you can get up there? I can try. Wait, this'll work. Do it. Be careful up there. Old damn thing's rotten. Looks like those chandeliers are on some kind of pulley system. Yeah, must be how they lowered them down to clean them. <laughs> hey, there's some kind of mechanism over there. <laughs> I have an idea. coming out of the ceiling. Right down. Is that a popcorn machine? Okay, let's see if we can find a way to that tower. Hey, Nate. Square tower. Looks pretty old. Yeah. That matches the one in Lawrence's notebook. That must be it. Nice. Thanks. Looks like we can get through here. Yeah? Yep. Yeah. Come on. Get it. Watch it! 
Watch it! Oh, thanks. Hey, Nate. Isn't this the same symbol that was on the tower? Yeah. That's gotta mean something, right? Maybe a secret passage? In a fireplace? Kinda on the nose, don't you think? Yeah, too simple. Hey, check out these suits of armor. Wait, Lawrence made a note about something like this. Yeah, here, see? Four knights, with an axe, a shield, a sword, and a morning star. Just like the ones in this room. Maybe we gotta turn each night so it's facing the right way. Yeah, but what's the right way? Well, well. A secret passage. All right. Gotta hand it to you, Sully. Okay. I'll push, you pull. On three, ready? Wait. One, two, pull, or one, two, three, pull? Just pull. Pull. Got it. Nate? Hey, you all right? Yeah. Yeah, I'll live. There's no way I'm getting back up there. I'm gonna head this way. Just meet me on the other side. You got it. You be careful down there. Right. Hope there is another side. The hell is that noise? I should be able to get through here. Should be able to climb up through there. Piece of cake. Oh, oh crap. They're here somewhere. Hunt them down. Sully.
Jesus, they put a small arm. Thanks for the gift, boys. See that coming. Hey, to here. Tower's right there. You gotta get inside. Come All on, right. Sully, give me some help with this door. Way now. I'm not really sure. Why don't we try going down? Hey, look at this. What the hell? It's one of Talbot's men. It was? But that's impossible. They just got here. Yeah, but what could have happened to him? I have no idea, but I sure as hell don't like it. Tiles. Sabean script. Yeah. Doesn't say anything, though. It's just nonsense. I'll stand over here so I don't step on any by accident. Good idea. Did Lawrence make any notes about this? Let me check.
gonna take long? If it does, I'm gonna smoke a cigar. I'm doing my best, Sully. Pitch dark in here. Want to give us some light? Sure. Oh, looks like some sort of laboratory, doesn't it? Yeah, this stuff's got to be at least four hundred years old. Hey, a little more light, Sully. Alchemist lab. Wait a second. Does this place remind you of anything? Yeah. Marlowe's creepy hideout, now that you mention it. Sully. Sully, this is John Dee's lab. All the way out here? In France? Well, he must have traced the clues back to the Crusades, just like Lawrence did. Hey, look at this. be in script again. But what are these symbols? Looks like he was trying to work something out. There's some sort of message written here in a knocking script. Think you can decipher it? I'll try. The altar guards the entrance to the underworld. Huh. Well, he did use magic to conjure spirits. Yeah, or the altar could be hiding a secret passage. Oh, right. Help me push. <laughs> well, would you look at that? Crafty old bastard. Why, thank you. Here we go. Sully, give me a light. Yeah. Ah, much better. You know, one of these days you're really gonna have to start carrying your own matches. What are you talking about? Whoa. Looks like they really wanted to keep something out. We're in. Yeah, give me a hand with this. Yeah. <clears throat> I got it. Hey, 
go. Looks like the family crypt. Your pal Godfrey must be down here then, huh? With any luck. If he knew anything about the Atlantis of the Sands, he took it with him to the grave. So let's find the grave. Exactly. Let's see. It looks like he was trying to solve this, but he never quite finished. This? Medieval game show? <laughs> Pretty elaborate. Yeah. Anything? He doesn't seem to be in any of these crypts. No. Now they would have hidden his tomb. Keep looking around. Godfrey, I presume? The one and only. <laughs> this is it. Here, hold this, way. Sure. <clears throat> Look, it's some sort of amulet. There's something written here. <sighs> Gonna do this right on top of Lancelot, huh? Uh-huh. It's in Sabean script. Well, that'd be from ancient Yemen, all right? Yeah. Exactly where Francis Drake would have landed back in the 16th century. Could be the name of a city? Yeah, from 3,000 years ago. Without the rest of that inscription, we still don't know where to look. Well, let's hope the other half is in Syria. Yeah, and the Cutter and Chloe can find it. I wouldn't recommend that. Shit. <laughs> nice work, gentlemen. Harris, please relieve Mr. Drake of the artifact. Yeah, Harris. Come get it. <laughs> now it's hardly worth dying over, is it? Your friend doesn't think so. Come on, Nate. seems to be dying out. Good luck with that. God, what a dick. Right? We gotta find a way out of here fast. Stay close. The torch is going out. We gotta find a way out of here. Wait, up there. Coming from everywhere. Oh, Gully! Come on, man! Come on, we gotta go! Go! Nate! Come on! Oh, God, they're coming through the ceiling! Come on, run! Oh, my God, these things are fast! Up 
up here! I got that! Jump! Get it off! Take it off! All right, you're clear. Huh? Yeah. How about me? Turn around. Oh, you're good. You okay? Yeah, I think so. All right, let's not go back in there. I think that's a good idea. Okay. We gotta find a way out of here. Damn it. No good. Alright. I'll see if I can find a way across. Watch yourself. I got it. Uh, on. Got me? Thing's gonna go! I know, I know! Hey, that'll work. Yeah. Just like I planned. Now we gotta find a way down. Oh, hold on. Shh. Every last drop. What the hell are they doing? Burn the whole place down. Oh no. Sully, we gotta get out of here. Watch it, kid! 
That was close, huh? You all right? Oh, yeah. <coughs> just swell. Here, just give me a sec. You always seem to forget. I got 25 years on you. Oh, come on, Sully. You're strong as an ox. Anyway, what's the hurry? They think we're in that. We almost were. <laughs> I gotta say, I'm losing the plot here. Remind me again why we're doing this. No, 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 no. If you're gearing up for one of your I'm too old for this speeches, spare me. Nate, these guys are playing for keeps. Yeah, so? What, you're just gonna roll over for them now? Nobody's talking about rolling over. Then quit acting like you're ready to lay down and die, all right? Listen, kid. I've had you back for 20 years. I'm not going anywhere, obviously. I just want to make sure we're doing this for the right reasons. You got your pride all tangled up in this thing. It's making you reckless. I taught you better than that. You're gonna get yourself killed. Oh, damn. <laughs> Hell. Probably get us all killed. Oh, no. What? Cutter and Chloe. Sully, if we were followed... Oh, shit. Chances are they were, too. We gotta warn them. Yeah, and get to Syria fast. Sure hope you remember where we left the car, because I am completely turned around. Damn it. Still can't reach either one of them. Something is definitely not right. How long till this place opens? We got a few more hours before the tour buses start showing up. Then we better hustle. Chain's been cut. Okay, so we know we're not the first ones here. Yeah, as long as Marlowe and Talbot think we're dead, we got the element of surprise. It's not wasted. Right. So, we sneak in. We find out where they're holding Chloe and Cutter. If they're holding them. Glass half full, Sully. I'm just saying, these guys don't seem like the hostage taken type. Let's just go with best case scenario for now, okay? We rescue Cutter and Chloe, and the four of us just sneak back out. <laughs> right. Sneak back out. It could happen. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Up this way. You check it out. I'll wait here. All right, sit tight. Come on up, Sully. It's clear. <laughs> I'll climb up and around. I'll let you in if it's safe. So. Ugh. <sighs> 
Come on, it's clear. The hell you been doing? Uh, the usual. Come on, help me with this. Come on, this way. We better hurry it up. Sully, over here. Right, back up. <laughs> Lower me down. Anything down there? Right, give me a sec. I'll check it out. What's that? Back up, I'll shoot the lock. <laughs> ah, crap, come on. Sully, help me out. This place is crawling with agents. Chloe and Cutter could be in real trouble. Where the hell could they be? <sighs> what the hell? Why aren't you in France? We're rescuing you? From what? We thought you were captured. Or worse. Wait, why? Uh, well, uh, Talbot ambushed us at the chateau. It was a trap. Yeah, we figured they must have followed you too. Well, yeah, they're definitely here. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. So we might want to think about keeping it down a little. Uh, what happened to you two? We've been trying to reach you for over 24 hours. Oh, right, I need to top up my minutes. You're using a prepaid phone? Mate, those contracts are a complete ripoff. <laughs> what? Mine's broken. Again? Look, just forget all that. You'll never guess what we've discovered. I've got it all in here. <laughs> Not only did Elizabeth's spy network stretch all the way over here, but they were all part of some sort of hermetic secret society. The British Occult Secret Service, the School of Night, the Hellfire Club, the Order of the Golden Dawn, they're all connected. So John Dee... And Francis Walsingham, and Walter Raleigh, and even your mate Drake, they were all in on it. But for them, it was all about the power. Controlling their enemies through espionage, deception, fear. Hey, guys. Wait, 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 wait. So Marlowe and her crew are the same secret order 400 years on. We cut to the goddamn chase, please. Yeah, we really need to keep moving. Sure, sure. Here, look. Quad est superiors. As secret quad est inferiors. As above, so below. That's the key to all of this. We need to get to the highest point of this castle. <laughs> Thus, the stairs. Well done. 
We should be able to find our way into the crypts with this clue. But the entrance has got to be hidden here someplace. There. That's the highest tower. Okay. So we just need to make our way Look across... Out. Oh, shit. Bollocks. Get down. <sighs> now what? All right. The only way to the tower is through them. Great. Whatever happened to that sneak-in, sneak-out plan? You what? We can't quit now. Yeah, not when we're so close. Come on, we'll find a way around them. <laughs> They're here. We just have to find them. Just wait till they get their hands on Cutter. <laughs> what about the other two? Uh, they're done. Talbot finished them off in France. There's an entrance at the base of the tower. Well, let's head to the top and see what we've got. Gate, perfect. Charlie, give me a hand with this. Go. You through? Yep, clear. Got it. Come on, follow me. Up this way. Jeez, mate. 
Thanks, kid. You saved our asses. This way. Come on. Up here. Hey, keep us covered, all right? Yeah, we'll just hurry it up, lads, okay? Yeah, we're sitting ducks out here. <laughs> right, here. You see? As above, so below. We're definitely in the right spot. Yeah, yeah, but the right spot for what? Well, the Crusaders would have hidden the entrance to the crypt somewhere in plain sight. Wait a sec. Yeah, look. That same symbol appears on Drake's map. Right next to this. Of course, Ursa Minor, the North Star. The one fixed point in the night sky. So if we follow that down to the castle, what do you bet it points right to our hidden entrance? Can I see that? Yeah, yeah. I want it back now. Use the scope, mate. I will, I will. If you're not going to use the scope, give it back. I'll find it. I'm going to use it. So, we've got to find the North Star. I found it. All right, now let's see if we can find that entrance. Should be directly below the North Star. There it is. Well, that's hidden in plain sight, all right. Um, guys! Yeah, just a minute. It can't be that simple, can it? Nate! Look out! Get down! <laughs> Run for it! Ah, oh, shit! Come on, you guys! These Come guys are insane! What the hell's wrong with these guys? They're destroying this place! Keep going! There! There's a wire! We can zip line across! No more! They're firing us! We can't!
Come on, we gotta move now. Ready? Let's go! Right! It's all clear! Come on! Come on, Nate, come on! Run! We'll find a way around and meet up with you. Watch out! Crap! Hey, mate, look. They just came it's across the wall. What about Sully right and Chloe? And They're fine. Look, 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 look. It's right there. We've got to check it out. No, I don't think that's a very end. He's gone. Great. Better do this quietly. Stay together! Hunt them down! Come on, this way. You got it. <laughs> oh. This is a... Yes. Oh. I know it couldn't be that simple. No, wait, wait, wait. wait. It, it wasn't a storage room a thousand years ago. No, 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 mate. We are missing something. Hey, hold on, hold on. The statues, you see? One hand up, one hand down. Yeah. Look, above, below. It's the same theme again and again. So, just another breadcrumb on the trail? Oh, it certainly looks that way. Let me see the scope again. Yeah, sure. Thanks.
Hey, there's that symbol again. Yeah, maybe it's not in the sky this time, but down below somewhere. It's got to be something down in the castle itself, then. Some sort of emblem or symbol. Wait. Yeah, there. Aha. Uh -huh. As below, so above? Yeah. All right. So now move the scope upward. What do you see? Yeah. Those pillars. That's gotta be it. All right. Let's get over there and check it out. Yeah, we'll meet up with Sully and Chloe on the way. They're over there! Shit! They spotted us! Come on, Charlie. We can't stay pinned down here. We gotta move! Gotta meet up with those guys. You two all right? Yeah, still in one piece anyway. Come on, I think we're onto something. Good to see you're all right. You too. Right. Here's the wall. All right, the crypt entrance should be here someplace. Well, what does Lawrence have to say about it? He doesn't. <laughs> this is as far as he got. Well, what are our chances then? Symbolically, two pillars are used to mark a gateway. Swell. Which two? And a gateway to what? Well, another realm, a holy place, a place of initiation. Oh, doesn't that sound like fun? Maybe around the corner. Yeah, all right.
Give it to me. Good. Now the journal. Thank you. Don't trust Drake. How's Charlie? Who knows? No, no, no. Charlie, you okay? Huh? Charlie? What the hell? <laughs> Look at this. Man, what kind of black ops bullshit is this? Let's just hope he didn't have a big dose. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, shit. Easy now. Look at me. Charlie, right here. Well, we gotta move now, okay? Just don't touch me. Get away from me. All right, all right. No one's touching you, Charlie. What the hell was in that dart? Your face is peeling off. <sighs> well, whatever it was, he's tripping balls. Charlie, listen. <sighs> Hey, you're okay. Get up! Oh, I won't let you take me. Hey, nobody's taking you anywhere. Just, just come with us, okay? Yeah. Oh, no. The floor's melting. We can't stay here. We gotta move. How? Our only hope is to find the crypt entrance. Great. Any ideas? Well, Charlie was onto something. I just don't know what. The Wand of the Magician. Oh, man. Without his journal, we're never gonna find it. Just let me think. All right, uh, Hermetic, from the Greek, Hermes, meaning pillar. I think we got that part. The seven pillars of wisdom? Between mercy and severity. Wait, wait, we've got no. this all wrong. <laughs> it isn't the space between the pillars, yes. it's the middle pillar. Balance. What? It was in Charlie's in book. The pillar of balance oh. between the two extremes. Between oh, no. black and white, water yes. and fire, yes. female yes. and male, the middle way. The middle way. That's it. Sully, give me a hand with this. All right, come on. No, no, no. No, it's okay, Charlie. Come on, mate. Up and the way down are one and the same. Uh huh. Here you go. This way. Looks like we'll have to squeeze through here. Oh. Right, you two go on ahead. I'll help Charlie. All right. Just, just, just. Go on, buddy. You're okay. Where are you taking me? I'm just gonna get right through here, okay? Why are you doing this? You're gonna be all right, buddy. Stop touching me! You're all right. Take it easy. Take it easy, Charlie. All right, we're through. Oh, wait. There's just another package up ahead. Just go on. I've got him. Come on, mate. We're almost there. Just go. Just go. Just go. Oh, God. Let's go. It's, no, it's, it's closing in. It's closing in. I just... I just stop. Stop, stop, stop it. Stop it. I can't. I can't. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. I've got to get out. 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 Calm down, all right? That's it. Charlie, go on, come on, just one more. I won't let you! Charlie, we can get through this. I don't want to hit you, Charlie. Charlie, we can get through this. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. Shit. 
Very simple. Come down. Or I just... <laughs> right? Listen. I'm not going to fight you. Stop it. Stop it. I don't want to have to hurt you. You don't want to do this. <laughs> All right, stop it. Oh, stop it. You don't, you don't want to do this. <laughs> don't. <laughs> stop it. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't. You don't want to. Let's talk about this, all right? Stop. You weren't. <laughs> you weren't gonna shoot me, were you, mate? Like a rabid dog. Wow. Let's try this again. I'll go first this time. Ugh, shit. Hey, follow me. No, no, I'm not turning my back on you just yet. After you. Huh. Oh, great. Next thing I know, you'll be putting that gun to the back of my head telling me about the rabbits. <laughs> hey, play nice, boys. Yeah, come on. You're almost through. Come on, let's move it along. They'll be looking for us. This thing should spin, doesn't it? This is 
is more than just a crypt. Yeah, the whole damn room looks like some kind of ancient device. Where's my notebook? You gave it to Talbot, don't you remember? What? No, I didn't. Yeah, you gun too. Oh, bollocks. Alright, we need to figure out how to get it spinning. Look at this channel. It looks like they were meant for water. Up there? Hey, I bet we can light these. They look like some kind of projections. They're marking positions on the globe. Let's get the other ones lit. Photograph. Just one left. One incredible. The beams don't line up with anything, though. Let's keep looking. Hey, hey. Is that the water? I'm not sure. Please tell me that you see them too. Oh, yeah, I see them. Whatever you do, don't let them touch you. Really? Just stay in the firelight. What are you doing? I should be able to make it over to that brazier if I run for it. You won't. I'll clear the way for you once I get there. If you get there, you're mental. We have to get the water flowing. You have a better idea? If you throw the torch down there, you might be able to light the brazier. Got it. Grab another one and try again. Looks like there's another brazier up there. Think you could throw the torch up there and light it? Throw the torch down there. You might be able to light the brazier. You got it. Ah! Grab another one and try again. Nice thrust. Throw the torch down there. You might be able to light the brazier. You got it. Ah! Grab another one and try again. Nice throw.
There's another brazier down there. You're gonna have to light that last brazier before we jump down. Nice one. All right, get on the other crank. Help me open it. Let's give it a go. There we go. What's the matter, Charlie? Oh, Kitty don't like getting wet. I hate getting wet. Okay, one more. All right, let's do this again. It worked. It started to spin. We should be able to rotate the globe now. Now we're getting somewhere. Hey, it looks like those light projections might line up with the land masses. Go on, give it a spin.
gotta be the entrance to the inner crypts. Come on. Here we go. All right, we're looking for a knight's tomb, just like we found in France. Now, if my hunch is right, we'll be buried with the other half of our amulet. Is that it? Yeah, just like the one in France. Amazing. Yeah, brilliant. Let's get it open. There it is. What did I tell you? Let's see the other half. Yeah, about that, uh, Talbot has it. What? I, yeah, I told you how he ambushed us at the Chateau. That's when he took it. Well, why did we even bother then? Hold on. Give me a little credit. There. You see? <laughs> and with the inscription complete, we know exactly where to go in Yemen. Thank you very much. Nicely done. Yeah, yeah. All the same. I think I'll hold on to this one. <laughs> all right. Let's get the hell out of here. Keep looking. They have to be here oh, somewhere. Shit. They must have followed us. We better hope there's another way out of here. Oh, there's a draft over here. Hey, come here. Yeah, yeah, I can feel the breeze. Awesome. Please be an outside wall. It's got some give. Charlie, help me with this. Yeah. Guys, we don't have much time. Come on, go! <laughs> Thanks very much. I'll take that. Drop your weapons. Yeah, I don't think so. Well then, what a dilemma. We seem to be equally matched. Until the rest of my men show up, that is. We can wait. Oh no. Guys? Charlie? Oh god damn it. Well, that changes things a bit, doesn't it? Now drop your guns. Don't you go cut and shoot him. No. Wait. Just stop. Okay? Now that's better, isn't it? Shoot him. You son of a bitch. Cutter, pull the trigger. My pleasure. Run! Go, go! Why on earth could you go to the gun? Am 
might have given us a wink or something. Okay, what can we do? What can we do? Charlie! What the hell? <laughs> you didn't get very far, did you? Hand it over. Piss off. There's nothing we can do, kid. Jesus, this is unbearable. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Oh, Carter. I had such high hopes for you. <laughs> yeah, right. It's true. You had potential. Now... Well... It's funny how things work out, isn't it? You betray my trust, and now we find ourselves here. As if it were in the cards all along. Easy does it, mate. Hang on. Nate, look at this. Oh, what the hell? This way! Okay, we can't stay here. Oh, just leave me the gun. I'll kill those bastards. No way. We're getting you out of here. Come on, get up. I got him. You got him? You cover us. Okay. Go! How is that possible? I shot him right in there. Shit! Ah! Now! Nancy, boy, waste time. Are you sorry? Get out of here! Get out of here! Sorry, Charlie. Whew. Look out! There's more of them! Oh, crap! Head for the gatehouse! Ah! 
Come on, we gotta get the hell out of here. That won't attract any attention. Morning. Not worth the price of admission, folks. Here we go. One, two, and a point. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Right here. I got this. You take care of him. I come. Sully, get us out of here. Looks like we lost him. All right. I'll find some place to ditch the bus. Great. You doing all right? Oh, fabulous. <laughs> that was too close. He'll be okay. No, I mean the whole thing. It just isn't worth it, Nate. Let this one go. Oh, no, 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 no. You can't just give up. If you let these bastards win, after this, I will never bloody forgive you. Don't you worry, Charlie. There's no way I'm letting them win. What is it with you? What are you trying to prove? I'm not trying to prove anything. Right. So what's the plan, kid? Uh, I guess I'm going to Yemen. You up for it? <laughs> of course I am. All right, we gotta find a quick way in. No hassles. Think I might know someone we could call. Who? Oh no. <laughs> no, no, no. You got a better idea? I'm all ears. <sighs> what about? No. <sighs> Fine. Make the call. <sighs> Elena Fisher, foreign correspondent. <laughs> hey, Sully. How you doing, sweetheart? Oh, no. Sorry, that's sort of frowned upon here. Oh, right. You two can hold hands, though. <laughs> How are you, Elena? Good, thanks. You, uh, you look great. So, against my better judgment, these permits will get you through most checkpoints. Okay, great. Oh, and I shouldn't be worried about what's in those bags, right? <laughs> of course not. No. Yeah, not yet, anyway. <laughs> All right, remember, you're journalists now. So try and act respectable. Think you can handle that? I think she's talking to you. <laughs> so what exactly are you two reprobates up to? Uh, it's just a little historical research. Right. So that explains the big rush? Exactly. No cursed treasures? Nope. No diabolical warlords? No. You are the worst liar. What? You are. Oh, come on. We're not going to start Excuse this, me. are we? Just... The car. Where is it? Oh, it's over there. I'll just take the bags and meet you. Nate. You're still wearing it. I, yeah, I am. <laughs> it helps in this part of the world. Oh, really? Seriously? Don't flatter yourself. <laughs> I see you're still wearing yours. What? Oh, oh, yeah. That's what this is all about, isn't it? You don't understand. I, I finally proved it. Drake lied about his route through the East Indies. 400 years ago, he came here. Why, Nate? That's what we're here to find out. No, I mean, why this obsession? I'm... I'm just worried. I can take care of myself, all right? I'm not talking about you. <laughs> what, Sully? He would go to the ends of the Earth for you, Nate. Just don't ask him to. Come on, that's not fair. What is that even supposed to mean? All set? Ah. You 
could just drop us at the edge of the city, that'd be great. Not a chance. You two are my responsibility now. I'm not taking my eyes off of you. If you're trying to pick up Francis Drake's trail, we should head to the old quarter. Ah, so this is the new part. Well, it's all relative. The city was founded at least 3,000 years ago. All right, well, lead on. All right, there. You see that tower up ahead? That's where the old city starts, so we need to make our way over there. Salam. Okay, through here. All right, now I need you to be on your best behavior. Yes, ma'am. No, I'm serious. The police, they have patrols everywhere, and we don't need to arouse any suspicions. You got it. We're just gonna cut through the market. Okay, it looks like they got the street blocked off. I'll go see what I can do. You two just stay here. Hey. She's still there. Oh, yeah. Apparently it helps in this part of the world. What does that mean? I don't know. <clears throat> so? All right, it's no good. They're not letting anybody through. Let's try over here. I know another way around. Thanks, pal. Good thing we've got you with us. Yeah, no kidding. Okay, up here. Yeah, it looks like we're not getting through here either. Gonna have to find another way around. Hey, up here. There's gotta be another way through. Come on, follow me. Two all right? Yeah, on our way. Guys, I don't think we should be in here. Oh, come on. We'll just cut through. It'll be fine. Just don't break anything. Yeah, here we go. would have been hundreds of years old even when Francis Drake was alive. All right. Good thinking. Hey. Hey. Huh? Talbot. Who? He's got Cutter's notebook. What? Wait, what? Charlie Cutter? Yeah. 
No time. Sully can explain everything. Hey, wait a minute. Meet you down there. Could you? Come here. Not a complete loss. Get him! Hiya, boys. Somebody can fill me in here. Who are those guys? And what does Charlie have to do with all this? He was working with us on this one. Wait, what was? He's not dead. No, no. Him and Chloe. Wait, Chloe too? Yeah, but they both bowed out when Cutter broke his leg. He broke his leg? He's <laughs> lucky he didn't break his damn neck or fall like that. He's fine. Just between that and burning to death, I think I would have jumped too. Not helping. All right, just tell me what you're really looking for. Uh, this? Come here. Sully, check this out. I think we lost him. What do you got? It looks like we stumbled right into our secret entrance. Well, that's our girl. No, not going down there without some hardware. Go talk to that rug merchant we just passed. Oh, no guns, weapons. He's not really a rug merchant. Oh, <laughs> right. Hey, just uh, watch yourself out there, okay? Yeah. All right, Seriously, what is all this crap Nate, no, you're giving you me about Sully? with me. Those guys are not here for historical research, and neither are you. Th this is about that Marlowe woman, isn't it? Yes, but look at this. I finally got it. And it's just like I said. That led to this. And this... Let us hear. To a hole in the ground. Oh, it's a glamorous life. Come on, admit it. 
You love all this as much as I do. No. No, not anymore. Really? Huh. Okay, well, why don't you just, uh, walk away? Oh, me? Me walk away. <laughs> That's funny. Shotguns? Why not? What the... What? Oh, he only had two. <sighs> Great. All right, just give me a hand with this. All right, ready? <laughs> well, well, well. <laughs> uh, it's cute. What? Because it's a well. Shall we? Hey, guys. Secret entrance to what? What's down there? Only one way to find out. Another non-answer. <laughs> you expected something different? Come on down. Man, it's just a sister, kid. You sure this is the right place? Yeah, it's it's gotta be. So what was Sir Francis doing all the way out here anyway? He was on a secret expedition for Queen Elizabeth. Yeah, to find the lost city of Ublai. Yeah, the Atlantis of the Sands. Under this city. No, 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 it's in the middle of the Ruble Kali Desert. This place just tells you how to find it, supposedly. Uh-huh. You know, this place looks familiar. Wait a minute, this is what Francis Drake sketched on the back of the map. See, check it out. These are the same pillars. Francis Drake must have made these notes when he was down here. Does it tell us how to find the entrance? Well, it's pretty cryptic, but I think I can work it out. These holes must be important. Guess we just have to find the right one. How are we gonna do that? There are a lot of those holes in this room. Well, there's gotta be another clue. Look around, we're missing something. It's an Anakian script. Must have been left by Drake. Can you decipher it? I'll try. The moon will show the way. The moon? Down here. <laughs> I am not hanging around this place till nighttime. I'm pretty sure it's a riddle. I'll make a note of it on the map. You're gonna mark up Sir Francis's 400-year-old map? What? He wouldn't mind. This mean anything to you? Yeah, I think so. So if I stand here... This is it! Sully, you go to that column. Elena, you take the one on the far wall there. I've got this one. Okay, now just reach in and find the lever. Really? I think we have to pull them at the same time. Okay, but what if you're wrong? Yeah, I kinda like this on, Nate. I use it all the time. Just do it. One, two, three. You sure that's the right lever? Listen. What did I tell you? Be damned, it worked. Yeah. Pretty amazing. Okay, so why the big secret all these centuries? What did Elizabeth expect Drake to find? We don't know exactly. Treasure, I guess. What else? The buried riches of a lost civilization. Of course, it's never that simple, is it? Rarely. And those assholes in the black suits? They're looking for the same thing, I suppose. Yeah, they're Marlowe's men.
giving me the creeps. Sully, throw me your lighter. All right, coming at you. so sure that it's treasure they're after? Not really sure, no. Weird. What kind of symbols are those? I've never seen anything like it. I don't know. Looks like it's some sort of mechanism. Someone scattered the gears all over the room. You think Sir Francis? Who knows? Okay, well, let's hope we figure it out. I think we're trapped in here until we do. Hey, this screen decodes the images. What can you see? All right, one looks like a cross, then the other has four circles. Hey, the same symbols are on some of these gears. Huh. Symbols seem to be rotating in opposite directions to each other. Okay. What the hell is that supposed to Okay, so Nate, did Francis Drake ever find that lost city that he was looking for? Don't think so. Seems like he only came this far, then turned back and headed home. 
and concealed everything about this little detour. Yeah. Have you stopped to ask yourself why? What do you mean? I don't know. This whole place just seems like some kind of a... a warning to me, that's all. Ah, it looks like some kind of ornate brazier. I'll need a torch to light it. This is some kind of celestial map. That makes sense. The Arabs used the stars to navigate the desert just like sailors on the ocean. That's right. So you could use these constellations to find the site of the lost city. If I had a sextant, sure. I didn't do all that time in the Navy for nothing, you know. <laughs> in here, I thought you spent the whole time looking for that basket act. <laughs> the what? Uh, never mind. <laughs> hey. Do you think you could remember this? Oh, well, yeah, but we ought to copy it down, don't you think? Uh, no, I really don't recommend that. Hey guys, look at this. Huh. Well, that's, uh, cheery. Do you hear that? Uh-oh. Oh, no. Wait, what is that? Get away from the walls. Hold on to that torch, kid. Oh, crap. These things are way more aggressive. Wow. Man, they don't seem to mind the light as much. Keep sweeping that torch. Elena, use your shotgun. I am. We got you out of here. Okay, stay close behind me. Keep shooting! for those damn things. Wait, you knew about them? You were planning on telling me, right? Hey. Look at this. Let not the world deceive thee with its beauty. It is the dream of a dreamer, a mirage of the desert. 
cup of death will be filled for thee. Lovely. It's all in English. Yeah. Yeah, it must have been Drake. Okay, so, so let me get this straight. Drake sails thousands of miles looking for this Atlantis of the Sands. And when he gets this far, what he finds here is enough to make him turn around, sail home, and hide all evidence of his voyage. Right. But you... You're gonna keep going, aren't you? Uh, yeah. <laughs> and for what? For treasure? Sully, he listens to you. Please make him stop. Yes, Sully, please tackle me. <laughs> <laughs> what is wrong with you two? Elena, come on, we're just joking around. Listen. You've won, okay? You've outsmarted her. You know where to find the city, and Marlo doesn't. Why can't that be enough? Find a way out. And how are we gonna do that? Over here, Nate. I'll give you a leg up. <clears throat> Careful, kid. All right, watch it. We're gonna send the ladder down. Hey, right. heads up! Got it. Get it? There. Thanks. Here, give me your guns. Can't take them out on the street. Ah, uh, right. Much as I'd like to. Okay, I think we're clear. Come on. We gotta make ourselves scarce before any more of them show up. All right, up here. This way. No. Nate? Run. Run. Easy, kid. Stay away. Stay away. 
What's wrong with him? They drugged him. What? Come on, we gotta get him out of here. Come on, stop! Touch me! All right. No, no. We just, we just want to help. Get away! Get away from me! Get away from me. Easy now. Oh, God. Oh, God. Stay calm. Come with me. Don't, don't touch me. Drake. Marlo's waiting. No, 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 no. It will all be over soon. Trust me. I'm sorry. Shh. Sully? Sully's not here, Drag. You're on your own now. Sully knows. Trust us. Follow me. No, I won't go. Don't resist. Where is it? You're with us. Just listen to me. You know what we want. Don't let, don't let, don't let. I won't let them hurt you. Yeah. them to us. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Good. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Please. I don't know. Welcome back. I don't recommend making a scene. You're not exactly here legally, remember? Greatness from small beginnings. <laughs> Beneath that cocky exterior, you're still the same scared, filthy little runaway, aren't you? Skip the mind games. You don't know me. In fact, I suspect I know you better than anyone, Mr. Drake. Of course, that's not your real name, is it? But we won't dwell on that. Mother commits suicide. Father surrenders son to the state at the age of five. Entrusted to the St. Francis Boys Home. <laughs> it's also Dickensian. Oh. Don't worry. She's of no interest to us. Unless, of course, we need to apply a little pressure. What do you want from me? Well, as much as it pains me to admit it, I need your help to find Victor Sullivan. Right. We already know he has the coordinates to find Iran. How do you know that? <laughs> you told us, Nathan. It seems your loyalty isn't as firm as you'd like to think it is. What about his? What? Wait. What are you trying to pull? Nothing. It's just that... Well, we've had you in our clutches for quite some time now. 
and he hasn't exactly mounted a rescue. He didn't rescue you back in Cartagena either. He just saw something he could exploit. I know what you're trying to do. Trust me. Victor is only ever in it for Victor. It's a cold, hard fact. I discovered it 20 years ago. I'm surprised it's taken you this long to figure it out. You're wasting your time, lady. Fair enough. But ask yourself, when he scooped you off the streets of Columbia 20 years ago, did he save you from that life? Or did he just doom you to this one? Ah, excellent. Well, we've located Sullivan on the other side of the city. I'm sorry, Nathan. It seems you've been removed from the equation. <laughs> وقف 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 احنا البوليس
Pardon me. Excuse me. There he is. I think you lost me, didn't you? <laughs> Come on, Talbot, this is getting old. And I used to go, what if I don't know? Short up, I don't short up, what if? Remember me? Ramses! You should thank me, my friend. Uh, right. Thanks. No, really. The English lady paid me to get rid of you. But me? I'm a nice guy. I saved your life. Right now, I am the only friend you got. Now you figure I owe you something. Is that it? Smart guy. I like that. You are way ahead of me. It is really a simple question. Aram of the pillars. Of course. Where is it? I don't know, buddy. Bullshit. Look, even if I did know, my life wouldn't be worth very much once I told you, now would it? You insult me. You're a pirate. And a good businessman. Give me some respect. Let's try this again. Where is Aram, Nathan? Look, you can torture me all you want. Okay. But I can't tell you what I don't know. Maybe so. We'll see if your friend is more cooperative. What? Who? Your friend, Victor Sullivan. I don't want to do this. At his age, it may be too much for him. Wait. No, no, no. You have given me no choice. Perhaps your friend will be more grateful for his life. Wait. You leave Sully alone! By Nathan! You don't touch him! <laughs> this is gonna be fun! <laughs> don't want to tell us what we want to know, huh? I'm. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh! 
Where did you come from? Rum. A cliche. Now we're talking. Empty. Of course it's empty.
here somewhere. I heard there's a story. Yeah, Ramsey says he has something big cooking. Who is that British woman, anyway? If she pays, who cares? <laughs> Smell of 
propane in the morning. If I borrow this... Doesn't look too dangerous. That'll do it. One shot at this. Back 
stuck on solid ground. Or oh, solid boat. Shot after this. He's down here. Keep an eye on him. Nearly there. Nice. Must be Ramsey's ship. Finally, let's... <sighs> You've gotta be kidding me. This place is a mess. Shit. Plan B.
Wait. Where are you headed? That must be where they're holding Sully. I gotta get on that ship. Somewhere. Oh, 
boys leave me behind! Ah! this.
to the lion's den. Damn it. Let's try to do this quietly.
outside. Down this way. There he is. trouble. I promise you, we're gonna end it now. You never had him, did you? Of course you not. I lied. Remember? I'm a pirate. Yalla, it's cool! <laughs> yeah, that's right, buddy. Keep laughing. Sora! <laughs> Oh, 
Where is that? No, no, no! Can't get much worse than this. Get out of this aquarium.
How's it going? <coughs> All right. All right, yeah. Yeah, I understand. Hey, can you call me if, uh, if anything changes? Oh, my God. I gotta go. Nate! Hey. I thought this was frowned upon. Shut up. I really thought you were gone this time. Are you okay? It's, uh... It's Sully. He's alive. Oh, thank God. But they've got him. What? Where? They're in a convoy headed into the desert. Oh, we gotta go. No, whoa, 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 No. No, it's not. It's not that simple. Come on. They've got at least two days head start on us, so we'll never catch up. We, we gotta try. Listen. I've got a plan. But we're only gonna get one shot at this. Okay. They're loading up a cargo plane at the airport. They're gonna make a supply drop to the convoy. Well, we gotta be on that plane. Exactly. You do realize that means parachuting in, right? <laughs> We've done it before. <laughs> Not well. <laughs> okay. I could really use a glass of water, and then we ought to get going. No, 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 no. No, my contact at the airport says that the plane isn't taking off until dawn. In the meantime, just try to get a couple hours sleep. Uh, I don't think that's a good idea. Come on, all right? He'll call if anything changes. Uh, uh, you're really going to do all this on your own, huh? For Sully? Yeah. <laughs> I like the way you think. I know. No, I... I mean, that's... I know what you mean. I'm sorry. I know. this I know but we have to do this quietly if they catch us sneaking onto that plane we're dead hey Nate over here I think we can cut through the building all right good call here help me lift this There's a way out on the other side. Looks like we can get out that window. But we need a way up. If I put it in neutral, I think we can push this. Here, I'll push. You steer.
How much further? We're almost there. Keep going. Did you bother to look for keys? Just keep going. All right, hold it steady. I'm gonna climb on top. Hurry, hurry, it's slipping. I can't hold it much ah. longer. Man, that's a big plane. Hold on a minute. I'll open the door. Be careful, okay? I can hear two guys. Okay? Yeah, you? <sighs> Feel great. Same thing? Yeah, I think we can do the same thing. That's bad. That's really, really bad. Get down. Up here. Them are there? Too many. We just have to get through here as quietly as possible. <laughs> ah, shit. We've been spotted. There goes the element of surprise. Just keep your head down. Come <laughs> on. 
follow me. We're almost there. It's just over that roof. Got it. Chat from here. Yeah. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna climb to the top, then I'll help you over. All right. Keep me covered. Okay. Hey, what are you, what are you doing? Helena, listen. Oh, damn it! I knew you would try something like no, this. Don't. Please. Let's be honest. This is a this is a million to one shot. When I almost lost you before, You're not good. I, I just can't do that again. So take that jeep over there and get the hell out of here, all right? While you can. You haven't got much time. Go. Thank <laughs> you. 
talk about this! Kitchen, see what I can find. Maybe some water. Something.
perfect. Here we go. Hating the sand. Okay. So hot. I just find some, some water. Some water. God. Okay, bring it on up. <laughs> I don't care if it's cold or not. God damn it. You gotta be kidding me. Now what? Hey. Where are you, Sully? Big Dipper. Shit. Should have been in the Navy. I don't know. Who I'm talking to. I'm exhausted. What are the roots that clutch? What branches grow out of this stony rubbish? Wait a minute. Son of man, you cannot say or guess. Wait, is that the... For you know only a heap of broken images. It's the well. Where the sun beats and the dead tree gives no shelter. The cricket no relief. 
and the dry stone no sound of water. God damn it, I've been going in circles. Shit! Ah, damn it, Nate. Stupid, stupid, stupid. under this red rock. Come in under the shadow of this red rock. Huh. <sighs> and I will show you something different from either your shadow at morning striding behind you, or your shadow at evening rising to meet you. I will show you fear in a handful of dust. Nate! Sorry. Nate! Sorry. Wake up. Help me. Come on, give me a hand. I've been looking for you. I couldn't find you. I don't know how long I've been out here. Sorry? Sorry? Sorry. I'm coming, Sully. I'm almost there. Oh, thank God. It's a village. Please don't let that have been a mirage. <laughs> no. Oh, shit. It's a ghost town. Getting through there. I'll find another way. I 
，全星云。Gotta be something useful here. sent to look for the plane.
gotta be a way out of here. This is getting ridiculous. I've had a Okay, hopefully that's the last of them. Oh, crap. The hell did that come from? Do this. English? What? English, I speak English. No, 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 no. Don't shoot me. Please don't shoot me.
عيالك والصبح مديت You are far from home, America. Shukran. You do not belong out here. Any of you. You spared me. Why not just kill me along with the others? That would have been... impolite. You are in distress. Even an enemy must be fed and sheltered. Are you my enemy, American? Drake. Hmm? My name. It's... Uh, Drake. Salim. I am Sheikh of this tribe. Well, I uh, don't mean to be forward, Salim. But I need a horse. I don't have anything to offer in return. You plan to attack the English caravan alone? You know about them. My scouts have been tracking them for two days. Why are you here? Why do the English cross the Rub al Khali? They're looking for the lost city of Ubar. Iram of the Pillars. They've taken my friend hostage. He's the only one who knows the way. Once they find Aram, he'll be worthless to them. They'll kill him. If they find Aram, we are all dead. Three thousand years ago, King Solomon commanded the power of the Jinn. Demons born of smokeless fire. Until they rebelled, he imprisoned them in a vessel of brass and cast it into the depths of the city. Iran became a place of evil, cursed by the tormented spirits of the Jinn. The English must not reach the city. If they unleash the power of the Jinn... We don't have much time, do we? No. But they have the greater numbers. We cannot attack them in the open. Tonight, rest. Tomorrow, they enter the canyons. We'll take them there. We ride at dawn. Follow me this way! You got it! Stay close! Stay close! Careful! This bus is narrow! Salim, is it much farther? We are nearly there. The convoy will be up ahead. Be careful, be careful. There they are. The convoy is right below. We have to hurry. Drake, save your bullets. They're too far away. They're out of range. Shortcuts, just stay with me. Come on, we're nearly there. Come on. Quickly, now is our chance. Let's go. Get on the traps! Take these guys out! I'll get the one on the left!
<laughs> hey. Oh, you all right? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine, but... Damn, I was sure they'd killed you, kid. Well, they tried, right? <laughs> so how the hell did you find me all the way out here? I had some help. Salim. <laughs> Solomon, thank you. We haven't much time. We cannot allow them to reach the city. Oh, I, I don't know. He's right, Nate. I've been trapped with those crazy bastards for days. I don't know what the hell it is Marlowe's after exactly, but it sure as hell ain't treasure. We gotta stop them. Drake, we must go. Now. Stella! Never a dull moment, huh, Sully? <laughs> Why change now? Yeah! something we don't. It's the convoy. Hang back, Sully. I'll go check it out. You got it. How are we gonna find anybody in this storm? Separated in the storm. Come on. Okay.
Okay. Get inside! Run for it! Head for the gate! That's gotta be the way in, but it's sealed shut. There must be some mechanism to open it. We just gotta find it. Let's look around. Oh, hey. I managed to swipe your notebook back off Marlow. Figured it might come in handy. Still got it. Sully, up here. Found something. Nate, there's one on the other side. I'll go see if I can get that one working. there. Of Victor Sullivan, I'll be go to hell. It's really here. Oh. Wow. Victor Sullivan. Welcome to Ubar. Incredible. This is how the city could thrive all the way out here. The whole place must be fed by an underground spring. It's clean. It's amazing it's still running after all these years.
That's a hell of a thing. Son of a bitch! No, no. No, stay away, please. Oh, God. Oh, no, what is this? It's, it's moving. I gotta get out. I gotta get out of here. No, no, no. No, I can't do this. What is this? What's happening?
contract. There's no way. No way out. Oh no. I'm gonna kill him. You killed Sully. I'll kill you. You killed Sully.
Sully! Hey, Sully! No, no. Sully, I... I no, no, no. no. to play, assholes. It's over, Drake. What's the matter with you? Kid, you went nuts right after you drank from that fountain. It's the water. That's what destroyed the city. Not the wrath of God. The whole water supply is tainted with some sort of hallucinogenic agent. Must have drove everyone mad. That's what Marlow and Talbot are after. Oh, man, yeah. Remember, Cutter said... 
They controlled their enemies through fear. <laughs> this would do it. In spades. But, wait, it doesn't make any sense. How do they think they're getting the water out of here? I don't know. It's not the water. It's what's in the water. Come again? I, listen, just bear with me for a sec. Salim told me that Aram was cursed when Solomon imprisoned the evil spirits of the Jinn inside a vessel of brass and then cast it into the depths of the city. A genie in a bottle. I know, it sounds pretty crazy. So you reckon that's why Elizabeth and Dee sent Francis Drake out here in the first place? Yeah. It wasn't treasure they were after. It was power. Only once Drake realized what he'd been sent for, he abandoned the mission. He lied to the Queen, told her he didn't find anything, and then hid all traces of his voyage. Rewrote history. Well, who will we to argue with Sir Francis? What do you say we head down there and end this thing? Once and for all. Look at this place. The whole city's resting on this cavern. Doesn't look very safe, does it? That's an understatement. We gotta find a way down there. Gonna get hairy. You ready for this? Let's do it. Amazing. This is how they move the water to the surface. God, the ceiling here. I'm surprised the whole place hasn't come crashing down yet. I don't know how the hell it's still standing. We gotta get across there. Help me with this door.
Sully, help me with this. We gotta get through here. Wait, the gears! 
Sully, we're gonna have to ride these up, right?
time to end this, you son of a bitch. Hold up a minute, Nate. You okay? Yeah. Yeah, I just got something needs saying, that's all. All right. What is it? Look, I, um... I had a lousy father. A lousy childhood. I hit 40, I figured I was never gonna have a son of my own. Hell, I never wanted one. What the hell do I know about raising a kid? <laughs> then you came barreling into my life. Look, you don't have to. No, listen. I do. I have made a lot of mistakes, kid. A lot. <laughs> and, uh, well, I am not a perfect man. You're not proposing, are you, Sally? I mean, I love you, uh, but... Stop. Just stop being a wise ass for one second. How long have you been carrying that around? Too long. thought I'd lost it. Here's the thing, kid. We don't get to choose how we start in this life. Real greatness, it's what you do with the hand you dealt. Hey. Hey. Going somewhere? Maybe. I'm really sorry about your ring. It's all right. I swapped it for something better. <laughs> Let's get out of here, huh? Yeah. this way. But... Come on. Trust me. <laughs> what are you up to? <laughs> no way. Eh, it's not as nice as the one you two wrecked four years ago, but it'll do. <laughs> Come on. See if I can remember how to fly the goddamn thing. Hey, this has parachutes, right? Oh, yeah. Three. Eh, more or less. <laughs> 